it's, it's on a delay. Welcome to PBKC Streaming Live. Beach, Florida. All right, welcome to PBKC Live here on a Wednesday afternoon. I'm your host, Ernest Christian, and the, uh, not the Ernest speaking Matt. one. It's, it's, uh, no, you're Ernest. the Ernest speaking one. I'm the speaking one. Yeah. Matt, what's up, buddy? Um, yeah. What's this, a 130 uh, buy-in, 3K guarantee? Uh-huh. Off and running? Okay, so we can proper leader in there. Hi, everybody. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Okay, that's enough where's of your, us. Where's your, where's, your, where's your macho suit? I'm saying, uh, uh, no, right that was, there, that was, right that was for the hockey game in Dallas the other day. That was really cool, <laughs> by the way. Who, who, who's your buddy, by the way, in that video? My with you? brother. Is that your really brother? Yeah. That's amazing. So when I said, you know something, brother, <laughs> it's accurate. Yeah. <laughs> you weren't lying. No, no. <laughs> so we have 42 players here in this event. Um, 42 is the answer. Yes. We are down to actually uh, about 20-ish now. Now that the break is over. 20-ish. Yeah. Hmm. We got Todd in the box here. As a J flops a 7-4 with a flush, flush draw. Rich spikes his five. So he's slightly ahead here, but a lot of things to go here. Well, it's a hot one at PBKC today. Yeah. <laughs> a little warm? The, the heat. And not just the basketball team. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, the heat is back, and apparently mad that it was away for so long. <laughs> and, and, it's, and it's only March. Yeah, I know. It's only March. Just wait to get to, like, April, May, and June. Wait to get to July and August. Because technically this, the hottest months of the year here in Florida is uh, September. August, September. Yeah. Hoping to mitigate all that heat, at least for a while, with a nice long Stanley Cup playoff run. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Extra games oh, down yeah, at the I Panthers Arena. Fingers right. crossed. Let's see Let's see and uh, that was Todd, everybody. Uh, Todd, Todd came with one hand. Todd, that's it. ladies and gentlemen. Really, Todd? One hand? <laughs> and we got Kimont, though. Kimonte. Boo. We can boo. <laughs> What's wrong with Kimont? We're playing uh, Nashville tomorrow. Oh. Oh. He's a big Nashville fan, so. <laughs> that makes sense. Now I'm paranoid about this thing. <laughs> What's that? Nope, it works. It worked good. Yeah, it didn't. It didn't show up in the in the restream chat though. So yeah. It usually does. So I was a little. I'm still waiting my lunch here. I, I ordered my lunch almost an hour ago, and paid for it. I'm that's all, yeah, yeah, that's that's the annoying part. I mean, when you pay for it, I mean, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> I'm awaiting uh, the arrival of my lunch. <laughs> Waiting. Everything in that movie is 100% accurate, by the way. F fair line of all time. <laughs> with the, yeah. Fair line of all time, though. Nothing waiting, though, but in, in pertaining to, like, waiting for things. Oh. Ace Ventura. The first one. Oh, right. Am I back in five minutes? Let's wait longer. <laughs> fair line of all time. Any movie. No, I was talking about waiting as the profession. So yeah. I used to be a waiter. So Did you really? Yes. Uh, when I was in college. Good movie, actually. Yeah. Maybe, maybe... Not, not, not like I never Frightening, had. Frighteningly accurate, right. everybody. Do not mess with the not, wait staff. Right. Not that <laughs> I've never they had. They will do that stuff. Not that I never, never had a respect for people who are in the industry, because I do. And naturally, I'm a nice guy anyway. Not right. trying to brag. Well, but, you work for tips. So, you know, but we, if, we, if, we, we kind of look out for her. Right. But if, so. there's, if there's an eye-opening situation movie that makes you want to respect who has your food, mm -hmm. that movie did that for you. Was that Ryan Reynolds' first movie yes. he did? No, it wasn't his first movie. Was it his first it was, major? It was very in his earlier movie. Was it was yeah. one of the, was it his first major? No. No, uh, Van Wilder was. Well, I was fucking up. Write I'll that down. <laughs> <laughs> I loved uh, Van Wilder. Hmm. All right. Ian now to the flop. 
Ooh. Oh, God, no. No, right. Yeah, draw, draw. Ooh, there it oh, is. Jim well, he both caught. Nick and, and Jim both Nick. caught, but Nick a has a queen. Straight. Getting straightened out. But with a forward like that, this won't be too hard for Jim to get away from when the situation calls for it. And it's about to call for it. <laughs> Two nuts say, what up, Ernest? What's mm -hmm. up, man? How you doing? Here on this beautiful, uh, warm, actually, March day in South Florida. I mean, it's spring break, so technically people start coming out, out here for, for that. And uh, Rich is shoving. He's here. shoving. With he the be heart, shoving. With the heart draw. He be shoving. He's up against two straights. Now, the dilemma for Jim, for me, it's not much of a dilemma because I'm like, okay, there's, there's two hearts out there. There's a straight that absolutely demolishes me. I, I see a, a bet, or rather a call, and then a shove immediately behind it. So um, if I'm in that situation, I got to think, well, one of them, possibly both of them, have a queen. <laughs> and I would fold that hand to that bet. Jim, however, does not. <laughs> yep. And a seven puts a straight on the board, as if Jim's straight wasn't dead enough. <laughs> yeah. It got up as a zombie, Walking Dead style, and then it died again. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that seven did to his My hand. boy Marcel on the uh, <laughs> chat, by the way. What Marcel, up, Marcel? Right. How you doing, brother? Well, I'm sure you knew that, but yeah. I didn't know that. So yeah. Th yeah. thanks for the clarification there, Two Nuts. It's uh, or Marcel. He plays here so well. He plays here so well. Right. Good player. No, no, I mean, player. but I, I wouldn't know that by that handle. That's true. <laughs> like if I'd seen him, I'd be like, oh, yeah. How's it going, bro? All right, so this is not our final table. This is our feature to final. As my compatriot said, um, we're 15 minutes behind live action. So I couldn't tell you how exactly how many players are left, but this table isn't full, so I'm going to say more than 18 <laughs> mm -hmm. at this point. Yeah. Just to update you on the uh, situation, uh, what did our player count get up to? Raise 45. He asked and received no response. I, I'm sorry. I didn't hear that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Was, was that again? Nah, I'll call it up. Um, I'll call it up on the uh, on the website. No, go away. Go away. On the Not website. you. <laughs> Poker. What was, what, was, what was the question now? What was the question now, uh, Matt? Um, the final player. Forty two. Forty two. Forty two. Yeah. All right. Forty two is the end. I said. I said at top of the hour. Indeed. Indeed. So, what that means is we will be paying five spots mm -hmm. here in our tournament today. 10%. No, I asked because I, I didn't know if we got that fifth payout spot. Because last time I looked, it was 39. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm like, nah, we got to get that up a little bit. And the last little squeeze yeah, in there, buddy. At thir uh, yeah, we had 39 when they went to break. But registration is open until the end of the break. So, I guess they got a few... Few stragglers to get that number up a little bit. Ooh, Nick's got the ladies. What did the ladies have, Nick? Raise 25. 25 hunch to find out. Craig's looking at Queen 8 suited. All right, tr got three in the hand now. The flop. Right, not enough so of a raise no to get rid of. So Nick is ahead, the Queens. Allen's just hanging out because it was only 1,500 to play out of the big line. I was there to say Nick is way ahead, dude. I don't think anybody has anything even remotely close to. Craig the drawing. Is, yeah, Craig's got a club. Heads up. Turn card ace. Ooh. Queen. So Craig's. Nick now. Drawing to six outs. Five thousand. 
gonna put some pressure. Wow. And he folded. Well, two aces on the board. Holy, yeah, that's that that is a phenomenal play by that's Craig. Remember, he came oh, out firing, and he kept up the continuation when he didn't get his card. Every time I'm on the stream, what do I say? It's all about representation. Yeah. And discussion. You may have a hand. Right. You may think you have a hand, but what he decides to put out there and bet. Yeah, Nick's not, gonna, Nick's not gonna like that if he watches no. the replay. Sorry, Nick. That's, that's great. Yeah, I mean, he represented an ace. That's what makes this game amazing. Well, it, it wasn't even the bet on the turn; it was the bet on the flop, and then right. the continuation bet on the right, turn. Right, right. It, I can see why he'd think, "Okay, he's got an ace. The jig is up. <laughs> the jig has been up." Raise twenty-five. Except the jig was never up. He was no, an allegedly. Illusion. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, that's, you always take a chance like that uh, whenever you represent an ace because you could always walk, as Miss Nancy would put it, smack dab into an ace <laughs> when you're trying to bluff one. That's why this game is very situational, hand to hand. But uh, that time telling a story worked to his benefit. Next time, maybe not so much. <laughs> uh, and Roswell 8 watching from work. All right. I respect the hustle and the slack. <laughs> I'll try to be quiet so your boss don't hear me. You get in trouble. <laughs> oh, dear me. All in. <laughs> but nope, a snap fold. And there's a quick 2K for G. Yeah, just help yourself to those chips. That's cool. Six, Craig with an A6. A7. <laughs> raise 3,000. Alan likes his ace rag, but... Jay's got the same thing except suited. Which always adds an extra element of drama. Flop we go. Not much for either A7. Check, check. Nobody wants to try to tell a story. That eight of clubs just killed Jay's straight draw. This will end in a chop bad. unless somebody folds. Fun fact, the eight also killed Alan's heart draw. Running hearts would have gave him four. But uh, Jay represents some of that board, and Alan believes him. So he'll pick up the bot. Start off with Jim and his ace queen this time. Definitely a playable hand, but uh, under the gun it can get a little sticky, so. Jay's got pocket eights. Suited ace ten for Rich. Nick's jack-8 suited doesn't look bad either, but uh, even though it is the worst hand of the four. But it's a decent hand in the big blind. Only 2.5k more to play. And there's the flop. Not a lot of help to any player. Jay's pocket pairs is holding for now. All in. And Jay's like, I'm going to put an end to these shenanigans right now. <laughs> 
for Rich and Nick and their club draws. Uh, only one club on the flop. I think if uh, there was another club on this flop, they might be willing to take a chance. But no, that both players fold. Yeah, one, one club's not enough for those hands. Jim with two overs, but... yeah. Not Jim enough Boulder. to risk 15 and a half K over. Yeah. But Jay did the right thing, though. You yes, have eights. It's, a, it's, a, it's, not a, it's a okay it's, it's pair. The, it's the only made hand, so you have to. Right. You got to get rid of everybody. Right, because you, you, you keep him in the hand too long. He spikes a ace yeah. or a queen. You're done for. Three opponents. Somebody's going to catch something against your eights. Exactly. <laughs> Barring, of course, hitting your two outer. <laughs> There's a chip count there. Allen on this table, of course, with the lead right now. Now, remember, of course, this is a feature Ooh. table right now. Craig with the bullets. And he's firing. I keep saying everybody Craig's wants good. aces. He's a good player, though. Craig's a good player. Yeah, though. they say everybody wants aces, but, man, they, they are stressful. you got to find that happy medium. And that wasn't it. The problem is <laughs> eight, the problem with aces, though. You have to raise with them. It you comes. Have to. It comes with pressure. Yeah, you have to raise with them. Now but you're thinking about okay, do I got to raise there? How much want to raise? I want some value. You do. You want where the you're value. sitting at position. You want you want one caller at least. Yeah. And I can only go to 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 my experience, you know, when when relating this, but. One, maybe two, depending on how well I'm running. Right. I don't want more than two. If I'm in with aces and I raise and five people call me, that's a real uh-oh moment for me. I agree. <laughs> yeah, I agree. <laughs> and I'm like, there's way too many people at this party. <laughs> I need a bouncer. <laughs> You're not wrong there. Six high. Winner. And cr oh, ball four, take your base. <laughs> ball four. Six, walk five, em. gets a walk. Walk very happy with that walk. A big smile on his face as he trots down to first. <laughs> I have to remember that. I'll have to, I'll have to write that in my memory. Next time you do it. I love when that happens. I so rarely get walks. I had five aces to hand before that. Yeah. And when I do, they're like, oh, these are so awful. I couldn't even possibly play with these. I, I got like 6-3 off suit. I'm like, oh, you had a bad hand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you got me crushed, buddy. <laughs> You see more walks on two five games than you do any other game, right? Because the because the more because the style of play, most players they don't have a hand. Which in is what I style. usually play two five when it's not like full. Right. I mean, last time I played two five, I um, I was on the list for like two hours. I just sit on a list, so I was over there playing one two. Because <laughs> I'm not gonna sit around for two hours. <laughs> Two five is a game I prefer because like it's 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 the one game that. Uh, um, well, uh, let's see. How do I go about getting on for one two Saturday streams? Um, I would recommend going to church and praying to God for divine intervention because I think that's the only way it's going to happen on Saturdays. Uh, there is uh, there are things in the works to bring back our one two cash streams, but. Uh, Sorry, sorry, I'm not sorry, sure sorry, how sorry, much sorry, detail sorry. I can go into it, right. but I do know they will not be on Saturday. No. Plans um, are not finalized, but uh, we are bringing the 1-2 game back. At some point, yeah. Yes. Uh, it's not going to be on Saturday, though. <laughs> I'm sorry to disappoint you on that front. We do Tormister. We have Tormister on Saturdays that we've been doing for a long time. Uh, it's not going to be Friday either, my guy. <laughs> if anything, you got better chance. It's gonna definitely not going to be the weekend. If anything, you got better chance yeah. on Saturday than on Friday. Friday is even worse. Right. Friday is one of our biggest tournaments of the week. Yeah, Friday is a uh, massive tournament. Huge tournament. The 10K guaranteed deep stack. We mm -hmm. get re repeat regularly over 150 people in that Where tournament. It's very big. It's very popular. Uh, and then Saturday is the bounty tournament, which is also very, but not quite as popular as the Friday night tournament, but still very popular. And uh, if that's all Josh is watching, because let's face it, he's always watching. Uh, if you'd like I mean, to chime in, me. boss, for some clarification, like I said, I don't, uh, I don't know what I can say and what I can't. To be fair, though, he's so tall, he's here really. Right. <laughs> queen jack against ace queen, straight domination, and no help for either player. Jay's here. He's gonna throw out a bluff with the best hand. Raise to ten thousand. 
And Alan's playing along. Drawing to two cards. No way he can know that yet, but. But uh, sometimes you just got to tell a story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a big uh, big bet there, and uh, the ace-queen folds. I mean, it was, a not, it was a 10 to 1 favorite, but you can't see the cards. It's <laughs> true. And with nothing on the board to support ace-queen, there's no way he could have known he was a 10 to 1 favorite against the queen-jack. might explain why I don't play as much as I used to. <laughs> I found I'm too reliant on the map. <laughs> L less about gut, more about map, right? Right. I'm, 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 I'm definitely... Well, like I said, I start... W as far as cards go, I started out as a blackjack player, and that's pure map. <laughs> right. <laughs> There's no... Really? Blackjack player? Feeling, really? intuition... Really? Are you serious? Blackjack player? Blackjack, yeah. Oh, interesting. Oh, I... Play blackjack sin uh, ever since my uh, fake IDs became believable. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell nobody. <laughs> I go back so far with Blackjack. I can remember when Blackjack paid two to one. Oh, if only I had a bigger bankroll then. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, I, I, I missed the boat on that. <laughs> By the time I got a decent bankroll, it had already moved to three to two. Now right. it's six to five. It's horrible. I don't play anymore. Four thousand with the KJ from Allen. The best hand we've seen so far. Jay's got a suited king, but King Four ugh, not too great. Definitely not worth calling a raise over. So thousand fifteen fifteen. Round of Andy's and Lions is going to cost you 4K at this stage. King seven off, king eight off. And uh, no raise in action. Battle of the blinds here. Who can hit their rag? No one. <laughs> and a pair of fives on the board. Anything higher than a nine, like a ten, will create a chopped pot. I was about to say, unless somebody hit their eight or seven, but nobody does. So, a pair of fives. <laughs> with a chop, that's fine. <laughs> right. So, the blinds are going to chop their money. It's, it's not quite like getting a walk, but for the big blind, anyway. Actually, no, the sm uh, in that scenario with the big blind Annie, the small blind actually won a tiny amount, won half the Annie. <laughs> but it's essentially a free round of blinds. I'll give up half of Danny <laughs> if I can get a, a chop with King-8 offsuit in my yeah. big line. Mm -hmm. Especially as we get to the later stages of the tournament. I will take that every time. Well, right now we have still three tables left, I believe, right? Maybe two? Yeah. Three well, we're still. 15 minutes behind real time. Right. I, haven't, I haven't looked. I haven't peeked into the future. 
a lot. Well, let's quote the wisdom of Macho Man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I am the cream. I, I never got a response from Craig to George about that video. Really? I posted on Twitter. Yeah. He never oh, come on. I'll, I'll be. I'll, you know what? I'll send a message, man. You know, I, I, I once. I once misspelled our color commentator's name on Twitter. Speaking of the Florida Panthers, uh, the very, very famous, greatest greatest goal celebration calls in the business, Red mm -hmm. Deer, Randy Moeller. Yep. I misspelled his name. And not only -E -L -L -E -R, right? Uh, -E oh, I put an extra E in it. Yeah. Oh, okay. And it's not. It's um, I put M-O-E, and it's M-O-L-L-E-R. Just a minor thing. And... And Mr. Minervini calls me out on Twitter, and then they put the tweet in the post-game show. I got called out publicly, as big a Panther fan as I am, for misspelling Randy Moeller's name. But I can't get him to respond on a on a wrestling-themed tweet. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> and G's all in with an ace-queen suited. Craig folds the kennel club hand. But like I said, we'll, we'll never make fun of people for folding the Action Palace's hand, if there is due cause, and right, getting getting shoved on <laughs> by a better <laughs> hand. Yeah, nobody's gonna blame you for that. It's when they fold it and they won't even call it blind with it. I'm like, oh, the disrespect. Jim with the Kings with the min rays. I personally find min raising quite annoying. And on the other hand, it's the only way to get value in this case, as Allen has three deuce in the big blind. <laughs> so Allen hits a deuce on that flop. Check. There's an ace and a jack on the board. Jim value bets. Allen might be wondering. Does he have an ace? And could I possibly steal this? As he did earlier. Uh, nope, not this time. Because he represented an ace pretty big in that hand about 10 minutes ago. And it worked out for him. When he bluffed against uh, Nick's queens with the two aces on the board. He did have position on, on Rich then, though. This, mm -hmm. time, that, this time he did not have position. It's always harder to bluff when you're the lead out. <laughs> J tray, 10 tray. Anybody not have a tray? Craig doesn't. Not that he'll play it, but. <laughs> King eights, but G's is suited. Battle of the blinds. Fight. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a crazy small percentage for Allen to finish G here. He might be tempted to call with his king eight. But unless he gets four to a flush, hearts or clubs, <laughs> it's not happening. We both think alike. We've been playing a long time. Uh-oh, shenanigans have been declared, which I need to put the kibosh on. Only a dealer can declare shenanigans at the table. And running spades. Uh oh. Uh oh. Still alive. No. Nope. That was a sweat. Yeah, that was a sweat. That was a sweat. Alan, that jack came on the turn, and Alan was like, oh no. <laughs> Don't do it to me, dealer. Running spades. For real. That would have been sick. But I think you and I have seen that enough times to know, like, hey. <laughs> It can happen. The worst one I ever saw was when I was tournament director. It was on the bubble to get into the World Series qualifier. Ooh. Here, I was running the tournament. Right. Rest in peace, Walter. You met Walter? Yeah. Aces versus aces. He lost Four on the two. bubble. Yeah. Oh. 
Because I had an aces over aces story. The flush. Before to the flush. Yes, I. Um, he was so devastated. It was just. I, I had to almost had to console him. Yeah. It, it was, was so bad. It was a cash game. It wasn't not not stakes like that. Right. I mean, you know. But on the bubble too, especially. Exactly. It was literally That's the bubble. The bubble. It was like 2010, 2009. Yeah. It's probably one of the few instances in poker where you're so happy to not be the bubble. You're so excited. You're so ecstatic, but you you do have a bit of winner's guilt, like because getting there matters, obviously. Yeah. But for most people, how you get there does matter a little bit. And I know I would hate to be the bubble or to get off the bubble like that. <laughs> That's just ugh, so painful. Like when I sucked out a two outer <laughs> last time I went playing pocket fours against pocket aces, I hit my four on the right, right in the window, and the guy's like, "Oh, I bet you're proud of yourself," and I'm like, "No." I said, "I," because we had gotten into it pre-flop. I put out a big raise, and I didn't think he had anything, and he he went all in, and I'm like, "I've only got like 40 bucks left. I'm committed," so I called, and just got crazy lucky, and I said, "No, I'm not proud of it at all. I I hit a two outer." What are you drinking? I'll buy you a drink, man. <laughs> <laughs> and he, he did feel better about it. He's all like, I don't drink, but thank you for the offer. Cause, and, yes, you did overplay that. <laughs> <laughs> I, had, I freely admitted it. I said I put out the big raise, and I, I shouldn't have. <laughs> but I hit a lucky card and got out of it. <laughs> you had spent like 10 minutes. I saw her come down. Oh, I can't bring it up. I didn't see it. She went to heat it up for me. <laughs> Seven thousand. Turn around that way. I'm like, what the fuck? Oh. Couple of ace rags against the queen ten. Seven thousand. I thought I saw the reply. It was there. Jay raising with the higher ace. Yeah, at least so far. Alan's looking like the kind of guy who's like, I'm in. I'll need. I'll, I'll have to defend. But now Alan is in. Big trouble. <laughs> he needs running. He needs running something. <laughs> Either needs running straight cards, or he needs running All threes. <laughs> but he needs something, because Jay hit his nine. And Jay's all in. He was running. Like I said, he needs running cards for a straight, <laughs> running threes. And decides, you know what? I don't need it that bad. <laughs> Not worth it. <laughs> and that's it for Kimon for now. Bye, Kimon. Good, Kimon. Good yeah. luck. <laughs> bad luck to your hockey team tomorrow, though. <laughs> <laughs> that's mean. On, Is it Anthony? Dude, they're they're on a 12-0-3 streak, dude. Our Nashville. And are they really on a roll? And we're we're resting, guys, because <laughs> you know. That president's trophy is should cursed, I, man. Should I should I bet Nashville tomorrow? Um, I'm not sure we can discuss that subject, mm -hmm. so we're just not gonna. <laughs> Fair point. Uh, yeah, Kachuk might not play. Barkov might not play. Cause, uh, Are they resting? Just resting? Resting. Well, they've minor, like, injuries. Game, you know, bumps and bruises. Gets we've, that stretch we've been run, off man. since Saturday, but. Gets that stretch run, given, though. Uh, yep, same for the playoffs. Because we haven't clinched yet, but any day now. <laughs> he has the same problem now. The guy's getting banged yeah, up. I, th up I think we clinch a f mathematically with one, one or two more wins, depending oh, yeah. on what Washington does. And I'll say what's in and hockey. Another month. <laughs> Hockey, especially what you see with the parody, home home ice is, is not as big a deal. Well, it is a big deal, but it's not a big deal. You could win on the road. These teams could Obviously. Win the eight, dude, we were the eight seed. Yeah. <laughs> Last year we went to the final. Obviously, you want as most home games as possible. It's a hit or advantage. But Running eights. Rich is out there. But the Nick kicker problems kicker. remain. Running eights. And Rich needed, uh, he needed a four. Then there were six, but not for long. It's going to go up to nine. 
<laughs> Very shortly. You want us to hold? Braveheart style. They're probably breaking the table. Hold, 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 hold. They're probably breaking the table. So while we're holding. Got to tell you about the show coming up mm -hmm. very shortly, April 19th and 20th. We're going to have Polly Shore, buddy. Really? <laughs> Polly Shore, buddy? The weasel. I don't, I'm not sure I can, I can, because I can't do the noise. I'm not sure I should do the whole weasel thing. <laughs> but uh, uh, long before he was in movies or an MTV VJ, uh, he was a uh, stand-up, and apparently that's what he went back to when uh, he was done with movies. And I've seen his stand-up. He's hysterical. Um, definitely worth the price commission. He's coming right here to perform at the Paddock Restaurant, part of our comedy series. Head right. over to pbkennelclub.com for tickets and information. That's April 19th and April 20th, you know, 420. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I think that was on purpose. I get the joke, man. <laughs> to get, uh, to come out and see Polly Shore. thought that one of his earlier movies would be anything and Sino Man, it's like, dude, he got to be in a movie with a Goonie. Yep. And the guy who fights the mummy. <laughs> 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 I wouldn't say before they got famous, because, I mean, Sean Astin was already famous from Goonies, but... Right. <laughs> and uh, he did that, like, he followed Rudy with that in Sino Man. Like, very serious, great performance. <laughs> You know, loosely based on a true story movie like Rudy, and then in, he's like, "Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go be an Encino Man with, <laughs> right, <laughs> with Polly Shore." <laughs> Polly Shore had his days. Man. I was, I was never a huge fan, but I, I like, I like some of the stuff. I enjoyed his performance at Son in Law just because it was so relatable. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I would meet a girl, I was dating his parents. <laughs> uh. Ooh. Right in the window and then double shot power. Oof. G is drawing to one card. Oof. Oof. And that's not it. Full house. <laughs> dun, 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 G dun, 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 is dun. eliminated. You're going to need a bigger boat. And just as soon as we filled, seat open. <laughs> Whatever you feel like it. <laughs> Dealers don't say that to me when I'm late with my blind. <laughs> <laughs> and it always makes me laugh sometimes if, if a player says, you're quite a strict dealer. I'm like, huh? Go to Vegas someday. <laughs> We're very laid back here. <coughs> Would you agree that more traditional he is the greatest manager in the history of wrestling, Bobby Heenan? I mean, I can say that now. Because I'm not really a wrestling fan much anymore. Right. It just, I, I couldn't be moved to say something nice about that guy, even though it was a character. And it's, it's, it, right. it, it, you're supposed to. You, you, the way you right. reacted to him. It's like, oh. You're, you're, you're supposed to hate him. You're supposed to not like him. Right. But you look at it now as an art form. Right. Now He's now phenomenal. It's, right. Right. <laughs> I feel the same way about Ric Flair. Yeah. But who? Ric Flair. <laughs> yeah. I always say the like, guys I hate, like when I was a kid, I always hated him because he was the bad guy. But well, if, yeah, I, if I like met him, I'm like, yeah, I could have, I could have a beer and hang out and listen to stories <laughs> from Ric Flair. That'd be fun. <laughs> like people say, you know, Paul Heyman. I think Paul Heyman's in a conversation, but I think Bobby Heenan. I think with the guys he elevated, yeah, guys that no one cared about, you attach yeah. them to, to Bobby Heenan. Yeah, the, the, also, the, we care because it's Bobby. Yeah. The only the only exception I make to that is Andre. Who we were supposed to hate, I just couldn't bring myself to do it. I'm like, no, Andre's I had awesome. To. I had no choice because I loved Hogan. Planet. Naturally, when Hogan, naturally when Andre turned on Bobby, I loved Andre again. Oh yeah. 
I was hindsight, always love Andre, no matter what. I mean, I was a, all the kids were in the in the Hulk Hogan when I was a kid, but I'm like, you know, the. Uh, no, I, 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 was, I was a macho fan. Ooh, yeah. So, so <laughs> for me, it was it was always Hogan one macho two. Right. When I became an adult, that flopped. Yeah. You see, when Hogan turned like turned to a bad guy in, 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 in WO, I was I followed Hogan's bad guy too. Also, so to be fair. Ooh, suited AJ. We got AK. We got fours. Well, we had fours. They're gone now. Fours are gone. And they're gone. <laughs> and gone. The diamonds. I was about to say Lenny's way behind with that ace jack against the ace king, but uh, that flush draw got him to about even. And the graphics agree with me. 51 49. Pretty even. Lenny comes out firing after that raise. Nah, but I never, I, I, I never followed WWE for like the longest time. Mm -hmm. you know, like after I stopped, I would, I would tune in. Oh, dude, I would tune into Raw just to see The mm -hmm. Rock's promos. It didn't matter if he was a good guy or a bad guy. He always had the best yeah. promos. <laughs> he's, you know, he's back now, right? Yeah, he's, yeah, I heard. I stopped for seventeen years. Hmm. Two thousand two is when I stopped. I still watch now, but I'll always be a, I'll always be an old school guy. Ooh, Vega, fresh off the Street Fighter circuit, apparently. <laughs> Cage fighting not work out, so uh, we're doing uh, <laughs> we're doing poker. All right, whatever. <laughs> Uh, nothing for either player's nada. Jay has the best hand with 10 4. Ran the river card. 10 high. And it's the winner. Vega has to bet to have any chance. Jay looks like he knows he should try to steal it, but he doesn't want to. <laughs> he's like, whoa, the surprise from Jay. He's like, what? Surprise, You ever see the Sixth Sense? <laughs> yes. He turned up. I saw the theaters. He turned up 10 high and won the pot. And he was like, oh, what? You mean Bruce Willis was dead the whole time? <laughs> that is such a shock. Waste of my damn time, man. ending. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Great movie. It's pretty good. Yeah. In fact, I'd say the only good movie M. Night Shyamalan did. <laughs> I just couldn't get behind any of his mm -hmm. other movies. <laughs> All right. Alan, this time with the ladies. He likes the ladies. 12K to go. But do the ladies like him? <coughs> They're too good not to show sometimes. Shows queens to the table. I mean, I don't show them, but you know, that's, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not at the next to last table at a tournament. I'm not showing anybody nothing. I don't have to. <laughs> uh, allegedly, it was a sweat. A sweat. <laughs> according, to, according to me. <laughs> this just in. I just told me <laughs> that it was a sweat. Gaming geek mode now. Fun fact: uh, Vega. Um, I'm trying to remember which one Vega was supposed to be. 
Uh, Vega was supposed to be Bison. Bison? Yeah. Vega was supposed to be Bison in the original game. Mm. Uh, they kind of rotated three of those four boss fighters' names because Sagat was in the previous one. So Sagat mm -hmm. stayed the same. So they kind of did a three-team trade on the name because M, but the M and M Bison was supposed to stand for Mike. And they drew the character to look exactly like Mike Tyson, if, if you remember, like the original Street Fighter, before they changed his look. You know, in the sequels. Right. And uh, Capcom of America was afraid of a lawsuit, so... <laughs> 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 Balrog became Vega. <laughs> Vega became M. Bison. <laughs> and M. Bison became Balrog. And then they stuck with it for all, you know, all regions to alleviate confusion. <laughs> so I'm doing a uh, watch along tonight on my wrestling retro podcast on the uh, Bret Hart Steve Austin match from '97 WrestleMania uh, 13. You ever seen one before? No. Really? No. No, I, I was out, uh, I think, wrest just after WrestleMania 10, I think, was when I, you know, bowed out of following wrestling. At the 10? Yeah. And you, you didn't watch any of the Attitude Era? No. Not in The Rock and Austin? No. See, I, I'm with you. I, I left out, too, at that time also. I came, but I was back in by WrestleMania 12, 13. Hmm. And into the Attitude Era, and then I stopped again for that. After that turn they were different two. times, man. We didn't have the internet. We didn't have... Well, well we had the internet. Yeah, the internet. <laughs> but all that stuff and everything I was doing, I was working. Yeah. I was, yeah, me I too. was running track Well, what, what got me and, was I, I started... I, I got in a band. And once I, once I started, started doing gigs over every like week and stuff and working on music and stuff, that, that was my life. I didn't watch any TV, really, to be honest with you. To be honest with you, even sports for a little while suffered. Speaking of smack dab... <laughs> oh, look at that. Nancy smack dab. enters the chat. Nancy! You rock. All right. Ace Queen against Queen Seven. Yeah. Yeah, this ain't it, Queen Seven. Need to bow out. Six thousand. Six thousand. Oh, and he ran into Jay with aces. You might say he ran smack dab into aces. <laughs> mm -hmm. And Jay's like, uh, 6K? I think not, good sir. And uh, some queen rags getting folded, so uh, Alan's running out of outs. <laughs> Alan says all in, and Jay is probably like, well, golly gee, what should I do with aces? I, I call, I guess. <laughs> so obviously, Alan can't. There's only one ace to catch, and it won't help. Yep. And some of the queens are folded. He needs Broadway, pretty much. Yes. Is going to be the only way out. And, uh, well, his hand is officially dead. <laughs> well, not dead, but right. he could have caught running 6-4 <laughs> for a chop <laughs> straight on the board. Oh. He's a little there. Yeah. Um, Allen is not eliminated. He definitely hasn't covered. But, boy, howdy, that's going to be a blow to his chip stack. Always with the shout outs, Miss Nancy. Yeah, hang out with us in the chat, Miss Nancy, because uh, the action, uh, there, w there, w there wasn't a whole lot of action the last four or five hands. You jump in, and then we get that aces against ace queen, all in, all in. So, Nancy might be good luck for the action. <laughs> <coughs> I don't mean the Venom antagonist. <laughs> doo, doo. Sorry, Mosquito. Raise it 
up ten thousand. Got it. All right, they call a mosquito. <laughs> Mosquitoes love me. My entire leg from like the last two weeks has been bitten up because of a mosquito all outbreak in my house. Not one to be undaunted, Alan. All <coughs> in. With his A6. And Craig, I mean, he, he didn't look like he wanted to call, but he's like, I got kings. I kind of got it, bro. <laughs> All right, so it's kings against A6. Into the flop we go. And, well, no ace. Straight draw, though. Deuce, no playing. And a 10 hits the straight on the river. Yeah, he's got a straight. I mean, when you've got ace rag up against kings, all you can think about is I got to hit my ace. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> Alan didn't seem to realize he had a straight. The six is uh, what saved him. Yep. Straight to the ten. Staying alive. Staying alive. Yep. Chip in a chair, man. Craig had him covered, so he was not eliminated, but he finds himself firmly in the danger zone. <laughs> All right, one, two, the blinds now. 5K around. And with these chip stacks, that's nothing to sneeze at. Well, I guess maybe not Lenny's. <laughs> Lenny came from that broken table with stacks. <laughs> I don't think 5k round's going to phase him too much. <laughs> At least not yet. Raise 4000. Actually, I'm trying to rock that hockey card, Miss Nancy. This uh, this my final season as super fan. Nobody's making me retire. I just feel like it's time. 25 years, I think is long enough. Is it wrong? I think you might undo that. You may decide to just continue doing it at some point. Um, divine intervention. If God says, I shall bequeath upon thee a dynasty of Stanley mm -hmm. Cups if you keep it up. And I'm like, okay, maybe then. <laughs> Short of that, uh, no. It's, like I said, doing what I do is not as easy as it looks. And uh, every year it gets a little tougher. And after, well, 25 of them. <laughs> All in here. Yeah. Great. Nick with his flush draw. Jim with top pair. Craig, top hang pair I, I mean, he's going to bet on the deuce. Who does he think he is? Steffi Mo? <laughs> you have to have pocket deuces for that to work. <laughs> Probably feels priced in anyway, to be honest. He's not a lot of money left to, you know, to get stabbed by it. I Maybe get mad about it if he wins. Yeah, Nick going for them diamonds. So Craig is uh, way behind right now. Yeah. He needs a lot of help. He needs a set, at least. Assuming that no other diamond hits also, too. Right. Like I said, he needs another deuce, just not the deuce of diamonds. He needs to deuce of clubs. a six. Doesn't help. And five and doesn't help five. either. So Jim takes no, that down. Jim that eliminate, eliminates with Craig. With tens and sixes with an ace. And I think at least Nick, at least Nick, I think, uh, crippled, if you will. I see Craig's logic there, though. Yeah. I think he's though he might have gotten frustrated <coughs> at that point. You know what? Let me get it in. Maybe I spike and I get max value in the hand. Yeah. I think it was okay the way with it. Well, it's good for good for Jim though, because he gets three to one his money there. Very nice of you to say, Miss <coughs> Nancy. But uh, huh? I said it's very nice of Miss Nancy to say that. But like I said, it, it, but before I step down, I would like to win this hockey card. Yes. <laughs> Are you promoting, promoting on your Twitter? Uh, I yeah, seen, I my personally ones. No, I mean, I, I, I talked to several people here <laughs> at yeah. BBKC this afternoon. And, uh, no, we're uh, we're cooking something up. Voting is open until April 1st. <laughs> April Fool's Day? Yep. Wouldn't that be the hey, ultimate 45. April Fool's prank? Mm -hmm. They could tell me, hey, you won. Ah, sorry. I don't believe you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would be evil. But who are you fooling? All in. All of it. And here's and wow, night of the living all ins. Alan's Alan. going for it with his AK. Hey, 
Ace King. Ace King. Ace King. Yep. But nobody he wants to lie. Yep. Nobody Just wanted to play with him. No. Well, <laughs> they believe him because he turned them up. <laughs> Not that they take his word for it. These guys have been playing poker long enough to to know. Don't take poker players at the word. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Make them prove it. <laughs> All right, Justin with 69, dude. Wow. And it was so much fun, we're doing it again. It's all in. Nick's all in with fives. How much you have? I left at 17,000. Yeah, a bit short stacked. He's only got 17K. So he uh, he's decided this is this is the spot. Folds around to Jay, with his, who has eight deuce in the big blind. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very annoyingly folds. <laughs> like, really? Oh, my big blind? <laughs> he was already 4K into the pot. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that does suck when the blinds get higher. You know, and somebody does that on your big blind. Because <laughs> you're always looking for uh, to narrow the field, as it were, with the short stacks when they shove like that. But cards just weren't good enough. <laughs> I've legit done that at a poker table. <laughs> and I know it's kind of bad etiquette, but like when somebody does that to me mm -hmm. on my big blind, I just, I look at him, I'm like, really, guy? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, what, call, fold? What are you mad at me for? I'm like, and you shouldn't get mad, but <laughs> it's just when they do it, I'm like, on my big blind, really? <laughs> Not on these other guys. <laughs> all right. Nick's all in for 22, but there's a catch. With his ace eight. Now Jay, oh, Jay folded king queen suited. Little surprised at that. Because the whole reason he folded last time was he had eight deuce. <laughs> but uh, king queen suited is, is, what it is something to play with. And then did it on his small blind after doing it on his big blind. <laughs> Giving him money. <laughs> Jim and King 10. <laughs> he gonna fold this one in the... Now he gonna call. He might limp in this one. Just limp a hand. Yep. Yeah, Qu King That's 10. Is it a raise? It's call. Call. No, he called. He didn't raise him. I don't know if it reads it or not. I just... Yeah, it does. It does. Yeah. It does. Don't... It does. Don't. 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 Stop jinxing it. <laughs> I get paranoid about that stuff. Blinds going up. Lines up. Price going up. Seventy five hundred around now. Inflation's getting everybody, huh? Yep. There we go. There we go. Now, Jay looks down at aces, and he has to be thinking, why didn't he shove on me this time? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Shoves on me every other time. 
but nobody has raised yet. That I'm pretty sure I've done that Dragon Ball Z reference before <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> with the raise to 9,000. <laughs> and Nick, that and we talked about this earlier. Finding the the that that perfect value spot with aces can be difficult. Mm -hmm. Oh, he did shove on him. Jay's got to be like, happy birthday oh, to oh, me. Oh, hit a reaction, hit a reaction. Yeah. He's like, oh, shoved on him. He did shove Look, on him. Look, everything's possible, though. Right. It's, it's, it's no, still, I mean, still 10 percent. I mean, there's the wheel. There's running. There's a. Uh, oh, a five right oh, in the window. Wait now it gets more interesting now. Right, no, 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 set. no, no. No, it would be boat over boat. Right. Even if he hits the five, yeah. it's dead. That's over. And he hits it. Uh, he hits, he it, hits anyway. it anyway. Oh, oh my the god. The case ace and gives the ace five the boat. <coughs> that this and game is oh. silly. Oh. Silly, 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 silly. Jay wins. Brutality. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that was rough. But you know what isn't rough? Easter brunch. Right here at PBKC in the paddock restaurant. Um, come celebrate Easter at the paddock restaurant with a delicious buffet. Uh, you and your family take a photo. Can or you can take a photo with Ace the Easter Bunny bear, if that makes any sense. Do you believe Easter Bunny? Easter a, bear? A, a, a bunny bear? That sounds like a D and D character. I'm a bunny bear. You know, like, bunny, bunny bear. Like you encounter a bunny bear. <laughs> 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 Roll for initiative. <laughs> <laughs> Not that kind of bunny bear. Um, we're gonna have a petting zoo, face painting, cornhole, and gem mining. That'll be interesting. With the water table as high as it is. Mm -hmm. But. Uh, Reservations are required, so if you would like a reservation, um, uh, call up the Paddock Restaurant at 561-683-2222, extension 199, and that is for the Easter Brunch Buffet, Sunday, March 31st. A little early Easter this year. It doesn't, uh, doesn't fall in Ma March too often. I haven't seen a lot out of Justin since he came to the table. No. He was uh, kind of card dead since joining the table. Yeah, buddy. But it works out this time. He puts out a modest raise, picks up the annies and blinds. <laughs> Somebody just bought him late. <laughs> no, no, buy-ins are done. <laughs> they were done at the first break. Vega all in with a suited A6. Justin's got an ace 10. Needs 17k to go. He's got about 54k, so that would be about a third of his stack. He decides, no thank you. Allen, who has played pretty much everything, says to Doyle, not good enough, my friend. <laughs> Folds that 10 do soft suit. One five. <coughs> Vega going all in with the canine. Jay folds an ace queen. And here's Allen. This time he's got a suited ace. He's got ace four. Well, not great. Twenty-one five total. Mm. 
and says, why not? Call. Let's take a break from my Mortal Kombat calls. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Alan's going to fight Vega in the cage. Spain. <laughs> Round one, fight. <laughs> and there's a nine. Only one club for Alan. He'll need an ace or running clubs. And, well, oh, he picks up a s some chop outs. And another nine for Vega. You win. You win. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> That's the last time I pulled eight yeah, yeah. kind of hearts. Yeah, Mortal Kombat calls are a lot more fun. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I was a Street well, Fighter player, you know, coming up. Yeah, mm -hmm. I just couldn't. Yeah. I, just I imagine. I, I still can't yeah, figure yeah, out the control no, scheme no, for Mortal Kombat because it's you different. Can't. I mean, and I just keep instinctively hold backwards to block, and then I just I just get rocked because <laughs> <laughs> that's not how you block in Mortal Kombat. So you block a Street Fighter. <laughs> All right, it's AK versus AK, Justin and Lenny. Both with AK, but Justin's is suited. He's got clubs. Raise six. Raise a six. A little three X raise under the gun. A bet that that says confidence. Now Lenny repopped him for fifteen. Immediately after, so that triggers uh, just a landslide of folded cards. Because <laughs> when you see under the gun raise and then get re raised. <laughs> Unless you got aces or kings. Run away! Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what we needed here for the live stream for that last all in? We need. With Vega? We needed Ken Bruno. Oh so we could say it's Ken versus Vega. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Go you can. You can. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't you imagine that. <laughs> and Justin's like, raise me, huh? I'll show you what for. <laughs> and moves all in. Lenny snap calls. He's not afraid at all. And they show the same hand, ace-king. Except Justin's got a slight edge. Slight. A slight edge. He wants clubs. And, he and rainbow chop, flop. Chop, chop, nope, chop. It's, it's all chop, done. Chop. Chop, chop. Run, go, get to the chopper. And just to rub it in, Justin got running clubs. If he would have just got one club on the flop, <laughs> <laughs> he would have doubled up off of Lenny. <laughs> As it is, it's just a chop. Place. All right, 10 trade, 10 5, and a 7. What? <coughs> Big lead for their for, uh, yeah, gym. Yeah, 7 with an a 7. With a 7, a roaring lead. <coughs> Jay decides, yeah, I'm probably not going to get running clubs, so I'm not going to pay 6K for a, a shot at it. <laughs> Tough to blame him. That's just for our edification here at the broadcast table, everybody. It's not a real peek into the future. <laughs> peek at some of those mega million numbers if I could do that. <laughs> if only, man. For 
like, yeah, re-upping my increasingly more expensive season tickets. I'm like, I can probably buy a percentage of the team. No, sweet. <laughs> if I hit that thing. And the rich get richer. Lenny takes down yet another box. Yeah, that's the mix. It was on his big blind, too. <laughs> Eighty-five. What? Nah, I'm just kidding. With nines, yeah, you gotta get rid of the rip riff. That's one of those bets where you, you don't really want to call necessarily. <laughs> mm -hmm. You're like, you know what? Just just give me a round of eighties of blinds. I'm I'm good. Folding the Kennel Club hand under the gun. Who does that? That's disrespect, Who does sir. that? See, Jay's going to call with Steffi Moe's hand, and I hate that hand. <laughs> That's not us. <laughs> Who is that? That is not us. No. <laughs> I have a deeper voice than that, first off. Right. So do I. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, because I'm Batman. So I got to have a deep voice. <laughs> <sighs> Helen has gone all in with Queen 5. <laughs> it's so bad. And Jay, he has to be thinking. He's like, you know what? This is what I get for playing with ducks. <laughs> Because he he look he looks legit annoyed that he's probably gonna have to fold this, <laughs> you know, after making the initial call. Mm -hmm. I said the the look he gave Allen just then that is a look of 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 a man who uh, who just hit his pet peeve. <laughs> Not really angry. It's just like, did you did you really just do that? But he's gonna call it. Yes, he, he is. is. Not gonna let the ducks go. He's going to play the Ducks. You know, Steffi Moe was on the schedule to be here. She's not here. So I'm sure if she was here, I mean, deuce, deuce, right on the flop. But she's not here, so probably nothing. Yep, nothing. <laughs> He's dodging everything, though. He's dodging it all. He dodged it. Wow. He mm -hmm. dodged everything. Yep. And Allen picked up so many outs on the turn with the straight draw. <laughs> wow. That was, I said, that was matrix level bullet dodging. <laughs> like the dealer put the cards out against the ducks and time just slowed down and 
dodge. <laughs> Jay dodged everything. Jay's probably like, I know kung fu. Whoa. <laughs> All right, that gets this table down to five players. From when I peeked into the future earlier, I saw 11 players, but I don't see that anymore. Wow. Oh, I was gonna check that too. <coughs> and okay, that's that's awesome. me. That's us. That's right. me. That's Oh, That's my stupid, stupid, pain. annoying pain uh, voice call. Like, uh, like, did that just happen? I'm afraid it did. All of it. All of it. <laughs> oh, boy. Justin folded that so fast, the graphics didn't even get a chance to catch up <laughs> to live action. <laughs> as soon as he looked down, it just, bam, just bam. Right, right to the muck. <laughs> Instantly. Hey, yep, goodbye. Pretty bad. <laughs> All right, Vegas decides king seven is worth 7,000. Uh, the, the small blind. And uh, Jay, this isn't the guy's big blind to raise. It was effectively a min raise because he's already 6K into the pot. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so if the object is to get him to fold, that ain't it. Now right. Maybe, now maybe Vega's looking for a little value. He thinks he's going to, well, a double gutter. Yep. King or queen. Yeah. A lot of outs, too, for Vega, though. Yeah. That's what any I mean. Any king, a, any seven. Right. So Jay's ace is leading. It's still Same leading. Outs. Now, this is me personally. If I'm Jay, I don't believe him. <coughs> Why don't I believe him? He took too long. Right. If he'd have led it's with that, bam, it's so much more believable. But when you sit there and you think about it, it makes it very hard to believe you. And Jay holds on. Two pair with an ace. But, but. I mean, if he's matched anything on the board. Ooh, and it's not that Jay has it. Because I'm not sure if he th he knows he has it, but that's a good bet. Though. You don't. I'm betting you don't have it. I'm not betting that I have it. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm betting. I'm, you I'm gonna make don't. sure. Right. I'm gonna bet. So I'm gonna bet you out of the pot. <laughs> betting against your opponent's hand. Oh, that's a thing. <laughs> I only say that because I, I had that exact conversation with a friend of mine when we got into it in yep. a big pot. Mm -hmm. He's like, you don't have it. I know you don't have it. <laughs> and he kept telling me that. And I kept betting. He's like, you don't have it, though. And I said, you don't either. <laughs> and you're not going to call that much because I know you. Exactly. Don't. And he angrily threw the head. <laughs> he was mad. He told me what he had later. He was on big draw. Like mm -hmm. one of those, I had 20 outs, and he just missed all of them. And I'm like, I just had a king high. <laughs> but I still win because you missed all your draws. <laughs> and I was betting that you missed your draw. I wasn't betting necessarily on my hand, <laughs> just against yours. <laughs> yeah, we're not friends anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Knew him for years too. It's too bad. That that wasn't why, but you know. <laughs> Dealing ends friendships <laughs> because I dealt to him enough, a lot of times, and he just couldn't hit nothing when I was dealing. So. Nine thousand. Vegeta. What? No, just kidding. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> Even though I should, in uh, Toriyama-san's honor, mm -hmm. recently passed, creator of Dragon Ball. 
Yeah, he passed that, that last week. Yeah. Age 62, I think, was. Yeah. You're, you're not to get all, you know, morbid. You're, you're a fear of death? Yeah. No? I don't like to answer that question. Why is that? Because fear of it won't prevent its inevitability. Right. It's not even worth the brain power I would waste thinking about it. <laughs> right. That's why I don't like to answer it. Right. It's a good point to have. Hmm. Like, if being scared of it could prevent it somehow, I would see the appeal. <laughs> right. But it doesn't. Yeah, I, I think my, my point, I think for me, as someone who grew up fearing it, I, f I, I think my only fear is fearing going too early. And more so in my case, in my, with my family, fearing you know, my, my family, young, young kids behind. Right. That's all. That's, well, that's normal. All I know about it is the Panthers are going to win a cup before I go, which is why winning one would be bittersweet. <laughs> <laughs> Worth it. Right. right. Better outlook now than in years past. Because mm -hmm. we'll whenever I would say that, they'd be all like, oh, the Panthers win the cup before but you I check out. You're going to live to but be I 150, don't think ain't you? <laughs> but I don't think, <laughs> as people who, who have been South Forest sports fans for 30-plus years, I don't think we appreciate enough the fact that the Panthers have been good for a little while now. Yeah. Like, the, we've never gotten the Panthers being good for a consistent amount of years. Mm. You may get a random year to good, and then they fall off for like five, six years. Yeah. And then another random good year to good in five, six years. They've that been good for about ownership. five years that was, now. That was at least. It was bad ownership in the past. Now right. We have great ownership. They've been so. good for five, at least five years now, right? Straight. Yeah. It's not longer. Yep. Yeah, longer than that. We, did, we didn't make the playoffs five years in a row. We just had that bad string of injuries right. that, that first one. And that's where Jackson I appreciate, Heat as a Heat fan, I appreciate the last 20 years, 20 plus years, yeah. is that as uh, a fan that became a fan the, at year two existence, we, didn't, we, we, weren't, we weren't even a conversation for a contender or a player contender much like. That's the why I don't get mad when the Heat lose. I'm like, we won. i seen them win three titles. I was there titles. for and, one and of them. And not only that, we're in the con <laughs> and every year we're in the conversation. That's all I want. So when they lose, I'm like, oh, darn, we lost. Oh, well. I still get better in shape sometimes. Yeah, 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 of course. <laughs> like if we had won last year or in 96, I'd have been like, oh, darn, we lost. Uh, no big deal. Right, exactly, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Yaks as long as we're competing to, to, to win titles, I'm happy. Hands an ace or a 10, and that's not an ace or a 10. So that's a Jacks so and eights, yeah, right? Yeah, tens yeah. and eights, beaten by Jacks and eights. And Lenny, Lenny has claimed another victim. Yep. <laughs> and Jim is gone. Yeah. Then there's four. Our chip we leader. We might be final table, uh, maybe. I don't think so. I think we're going to get balanced first. Right, either a balance or final table. Final. We'll see. Before the year. We're closing on final table. We are closing in, though. Oh, no. Holy action. We'll see what happens here. Yeah, we're going to find out. Yeah, it's nine. So we're just going to hang out for a little bit. Right. That's correct. Because you can't play with four, dude. <laughs> He's just asking questions. All right. Well, while we're waiting, coming soon to our poker room and right here at the Action Palace is going to be our April Monster Multi-Flight Poker Tournament. Starts April 4th and runs through April 7th. We're gonna. It's going to be a $300 buy-in. 100K guarantee, and it all starts on Thursday, April 4th. We're going to have uh, two flights Friday and two flights Saturday. So we're going to have a total of five day ones, and then Sunday is going to be day two. 100K guarantee, $300 buy-in, mm -hmm. pbkennelclub.com for more info. But that's coming up. So it's set one player down. Yeah, it looks like we're going to get a balance here before we yeah, get final. Definitely. Also, coming up to uh, the Paddock Concert Series on April 26th, we're going to have Petty Nicks, an iconic tribute to Tom Petty and Stevie Nicks. 
Oh wow, Penny Nix. Interesting. Yeah, Penny Nix. Interesting. Uh, PBCountryClub.com for more tickets and info. Yeah, getting a lot of the tribute music here. We've uh, had several of the uh, Elvis shows recently. Say bet we're gonna get more. Not that I'm the biggest Very Elvis fan, up. but when we renewed our vows, I did get married by an Elvis uh, minister, though. Oh, really? Cause, yeah. Back to live action, and look who it is. Matt, not me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Vegas got the Ducks this time. To the flop they go, and wow. Vega flops a set. <laughs> and slow plays it. Lenny doesn't take the bait, though. He's got ace jack. Doesn't have any really anything to bet. So does Vega. He's thinking about his move. And he says 8,000. Lenny's got two overs to that flop, so he's gonna play for a river card. They say one of the worst things in poker is drawing dead and getting there. Lenny does not get there. Vega taking a, he's taking a while with his decision here. Decides to bet 12k. Lenny missed everything. He asked Vega what he has. Vega says 5-2. Our graphics say pocket deuces, but 5-2 is enough. So it, it matters not if, <laughs> if he's telling the truth or not. A deuce uh, does indeed beat his 5-deuce. All right, Lenny's got aces this time. His position's not the greatest, but. 12. Decides to go with a 3x raise. Let's just hold, 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 hold. Yeah, Joey, our tournament director, comes over and says, hold the action after that hand, and well. That means your pile table. Yep. Three X-rays on on Jay's big blind, <laughs> which is why Jay was thinking about a trail a little mm -hmm. longer than I think he normally would have. <laughs> normally, that's an insta mug. All right, but pile table guys. When you're 8K into a pot, <laughs> and somebody goes 12K. All right. He thinks I should have saved that promo for. Uh <laughs> They're reseeding here. Actually, you guys are banging the same time. Take your chair. 
All right. So um, it's part of the randomness of the tournaments, um, especially for a player like Lenny, I would think, because who has the most chips. You just hate moving <laughs> at the same time. Yeah. But it's n it's necessary. Where's the button? Uh, it'll be in seat five. I mean, I think we're going to draw for the button. Yeah, you draw for the button. If you guys want to use the restroom, now is your time. Yeah, so, uh, all right. All right, so as I set up the table here, we get back, to, back into action, back into the camera. Yeah, so, it's been uh, pretty like we said, Polly Shore. Polly Shore, what, 19th, 19th and 20th? 20th? Yeah. yeah. That's going to be good. And I won't be around for that weekend, I don't, unfortunately. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be here. I won't be, I won't be here. I have, I'll be I'm away for the weekend. I'm actually on vacation that week, so. Guys, my hockey schedule only covers the regular season for now, and the last game is the 16th, so. Yeah, I'll be. On, I actually, I'll be on Orlando. Probably are gonna have home ice in the first round. So I'll be on a little. <laughs> I'll be on a, on a mini, mini family vacation that weekend. Hey, so. but that's why it's two nights. It's true. But two I won't get back till Sunday. So. Yeah, they're not gonna make us play a back to back no. again no. at home. No. no, like they did in 2016. Are no. you NHL? <laughs> they did that. We'll still times. find out. <laughs> right. We'll still find out. Well, they, they had a concert. That's uh, why okay. we kind of had to do the back-to-backs because – They avoid it if they have to. They right. can't, and if they can't avoid it, they can't avoid it. It, is what it was it is. just really bad. <laughs> All right. So uh, they're, they're moving stuff around. So, mm -hmm. yeah, and we got Petty Nicks. We got uh, we got the Easter brunch coming up. Brunch buffet, which sounds amazing, actually. <laughs> well, what the Rooney 5K also? Who's we? The Rooney 5K, I said. Oh, I thought you said we're running it. I'm like, we are? are you, I, I might I'm run not it, running. I'm thinking about running it, actually. No. No, I, I I had to make the decision to uh, put myself back on the injured list. You hurt still? Because uh, my left knee. Ooh. Not yeah, good. I mean it's not it's not bad. It's just it's just really cricky. Yeah. <laughs> and whenever your, your, your I whenever, are, whenever I have over. to run from the parking lot in, if I'm running late, just running that you know about hundred yards or something, yeah. it'll, it'll start to like your running days are it over. It doesn't hurt, but it's like it's getting there. It's mm -hmm. like my knee is saying, dude, you're you're 47. <laughs> And you it haven't run competitively since you were 21. Over. Right, right. So, yeah, stop with the whole running thing. Yeah. <laughs> or this knee will buckle. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, it is my, still my, for a great cause. I'm still, still going to volunteer for it. It's not like I'm not yeah. going to participate. You mm -hmm. know, still, still going to be there. My right knee always – my right, my left knee always snaps once in a while for a reason. All right, we're going to go back to the table. All right, so uh, it's not really a break break. It's just it's a just kidding break. <laughs> See, Vegas here, and he's ready to play. So he's like, <laughs> they're just uh, getting to their new seats and getting the names and chip counts and everything. And we'll be back to live action very soon. Mm -hmm. Within seconds. <laughs> well, maybe not seconds. Maybe like a minute. <laughs> Yeah, that's me. Which is <laughs> <laughs> just why I don't go on vacation. <laughs> that's uh, that's the latest goings on. Uh, it's it's like I'm a bachelor again. <laughs> my wife is going on vacation. Apparently, she's had enough of my hockey road trip, so she's doing a uh, theater road trip right. <laughs> with her uncle up in uh, New York City, hitting up the Broadway shows. <laughs> And since I'm a man, apparently I'm incapable of caring for our child, so she's <laughs> right. she's with the in-laws. Oh, you get that too? <laughs> <laughs> so it's not just me. I'm not getting picked on. <laughs> I guess it was a well. Not okay. all the time, but it was a well. I get that. It's the, why is that? <laughs> it is what it is, brother. I mean, it's not so much that I can't take care of the kid. 
I, I think my wife is legit scared that I won't bring her to school. Because we, I've been off the last couple of days, so I'm like, let's play hooky and just go to Universal. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> because I spend all that money for the annual passes, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm like, you know what, let's just go. You're not learning anything in school. You know? I have a very Rick and Morty outlook <laughs> about school. Like, it, it's not a place for smart people. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Any any teachers watching, just unsubscribe. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Uh, and Joey even told him it's not a break break. You're both Vega and the, might, the like, might be, dude, might be, like, dude, where did everybody go? It may be a break. It's not a break. It, it may be a break. It can't be a break. Well, yeah, so you mean, break. now you yelled again. It's not a break. Everybody get back to the table, dude. <laughs> So it was just going to be a couple minutes to get names and chip stacks, you know, and then move everybody around. It's not a break. Like I said, she even asked me if I was going to do that. I'm like, you're going to take her to school, right? Or do I have to give her to my to my parents so that, right. that she goes to school? I'm like, man. <laughs> I was going to be real slick about it, too. I was going to take her to the school and just be like, hey, do you want to go to Universal instead of school? What do you think? <laughs> and then just go. <laughs> Universal. I was totally going to do that. Because what kid would say school? Come on. <laughs> None would. There's not a child on this planet that would say school. Exactly. <coughs> the only thing is she won't ride the whole roller coaster by herself. Hulk is tough. So she wouldn't, she wouldn't be able to ride it. Because I, I don't fit in the damn things. <laughs> So I can't go. I'm like I I, I wrote it once. I don't I don't need to write it again. <laughs> yeah. Common rule. It's so common and everybody knows it. They're all like, yeah, yeah, we know. But if you've been watching the show, you'd see yes, they discuss chops or try to quite frequently <laughs> when they've started a new hand. They're like, well, you said no, but what about this other way? Well, the cards are in the air. Like, you, you can't freaking do that, get my guy. <laughs> All right, so we've had to. And I'm looking at the table and think, did anybody get to keep their seat? There is a one in nine shot at that. And yep. it would appear no. Nobody got to keep their seat. <laughs> All right, where to go? All right, back to live action. Right, Joey's doing a fantastic job as the tournament director. Yeah. A pimp named Hawk says, "What's up, fam? What's up, buddy?" Yeah, pimp named Hawk. He he would always bother me about not going to play when I was in Dallas, and then it turns out it was all a prank. He's like, "No, I'm not really in Dallas." Haha, -ha. <coughs> and I'm like, "Because <laughs> I went to Dallas a couple of weeks for the hockey game." And I'm yeah. like, "I told my brother like, last week. Radio, last radio week? silence. It was last week. <laughs> it was last week, right?" Yeah. Well, yeah, it was it was last week, Monday, Tuesday. Time flies that fast. If you think it's that a couple weeks ago, yeah, it seems like it. The trip was long. <laughs> oh, Ray was in Dallas, yeah. Well, I was there for the Panthers Stars game. The epic comeback. We got our butts kicked for 50 minutes. Yep. And then the last 10 minutes, we scored three in a row to steal the game 4-3. <laughs> it's a great game. At Star at Stars fans. All giving me, you know, not, not like giving me grief, but you know, just kind of be like, aha, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just were kind of rubbing it in. But they got real quiet there at the end. Yep. <laughs> All in case was ace queen here, and there's the ace, ace in the window. window. Oh, two aces in the window. Flops up full house. Oh, running kings Ooh, is that's the only way out. Pretty much over. And that's yeah. Not a king. Yeah. Yeah, it's over. A that's double it. boat. Aces full of queens and eights. That's like a full bungalow. And John is gone. <laughs> Just like that. Yeah. Anthony, that's brutal, man. Yeah. That's, that's brutal. Like the worst when it's like yeah. <laughs> Kings <laughs> and ace queen. <laughs> they call them ace magnets for a reason. I know. Yeah, I'm done <laughs> Tim Namehawk says Kings takes me out of more right <laughs> mm -hmm. than any other hand. Yeah, I imagine that's that's a common uh, lament. I don't know. Maybe I'm just lucky. I I rarely get bounced from a tournament with Ace King. I mean, probably because I'm skeptical of it and I don't you know play it for big you know. 
I don't shove with it, really. I actually do well with that hand, but... I mean, my all-ins... <laughs> when I'm sure it's that. I just don't seem to get that hand. Right. I mean, ace rag is a common elimination hand for me. Like, I'm getting short stack, I'm getting blinded out. I see, like, an a7 suited. I'm like, all right, uh, I'm card dead. So I think it's not going to get any better than this. Mm -hmm. And I'll go with that. If I would just get frickin' ace king when I'm short stacked, it, that percentage would probably go up. <laughs> All right, speaking of big tournaments, uh, we have dates. The Moneymaker Tour returns. To the Palm Beach Kennel Club, May 2nd through the 14th. Over half a million birthday. guarantees. <coughs> 28 <coughs> events. And, of course, live streaming for most of the events. You can catch us bringing you the action if you can't make it yourself. But why can't you make it yourself? Head on over to moneymakerpt.com for more tickets and information. That's May 2nd through the 14th for the Moneymaker Tour. Like I said, they got a lot of great events. And yeah, 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 right. It's not even a, a, a criticism, yeah, but like the closest thing to a criticism I would have is that yeah, we can't play. <laughs> right. <laughs> I want to play. I see a lot of these events, and I'm like, I want to play too. I know. It's not like the WSOP where they have a dealer event. That would rule. <laughs> like in the off chance anybody from the tour is watching, at a dealer event and have it at like all of them. So, you know, because I see the moneymaker – Tour going around right. to different spots. Him named Hawks has a bad word and then forgot today is Wednesday. You're late for poker study? What are you talking about? You're studying poker right now. <laughs> 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 All right, thanks for dropping in, Pim. Always good to see you. Gets Brian to fold the ace. Does Gene, who I guess was on the other table. Because we have not seen him before this table, but uh, looking around this table, we uh, we got a lot of the usual suspects here. Everybody except Kaiser Soze. It's the only game in the world where you could do everything wrong and and still win. But um, there's another saying too. There's a lot of familiar faces at final tables. <laughs> a lot. Especially just Brian's here, Gene's here, Matt's here, Adam's here, Lenny's here. Uh, I think Vega is the only uh, like new new face. Some dude was looking on Friday. He was like, "Okay." All right, Lenny. All right, it was Brian that raised with the hockey sticks. Lenny calls with Ace Jack. Justin doesn't like the suited Ace Rag. Gene folds Doyle out of the small blind. So it's Brian's sevens against Lenny's Ace Jack. There you go, it's a flop. Like, right, cool. Four to window. And no, it's not the window. <laughs> the <laughs> ace, the <laughs> like last time. He just won first that was place. sick. And I grabbed, the, I, I grabbed those plants right there. I'm like, here's your trophy, bro. I grabbed the plants. <laughs> yeah. Brian yeah. makes a 10K yeah. to go. Yeah. No. And Lenny's like, eh, it didn't flop my A or my J. I'll give you a trophy, all right? I'm so going to give you that. Plants. And they're still He'll light, dip too. out. The little plants are light. They're very light. I just cut off one of the leaves. I just want first place, you know, for my kids, so they can see me. Like, yeah, I'm exactly. Like that. You know, every time I go home, they think I lose money. That's what he said, bro. I was like, I was wow. Like, I'm sorry, man. <laughs> I gotta show them something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's uh, yeah. Oh, it's it's a big reason yeah, why I don't tell, I don't tell my wife play. when I go play. Yeah. <laughs> what, what do you do? I need to get to him. Just doesn't end well. And she she doesn't Never mind does. that I play really. I just um, you know, I'm just. 
trying to make a joke, but... Whenever I try to say anything about her spending. <laughs> He's like, oh, but you can go gamble and play cards, right? <laughs> Which is why I don't tell her. <laughs> oh, that's a good crack at I was winning already. Yes. Yes, you were. <laughs> yeah, 8 6 is. You're not that strong to call an all in. Yeah, you would win. That's what I need. Ten bigs, I shouldn't say it, but oh. you know, I don't want to say Daryl bigs. You guys want to start the clock? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm the shortest snack, so I was gonna let it ride for a bit, but <laughs> that's fine. That's cool. uh, but I don't really want to be here till then, anyway. Win or lose. Yeah, you're right. No, Jackson's gonna. Why has the black been the state for the longest? Yeah, yeah. It's 8 p.m. and it's still 2-4. What's going on? I don't know what time these cards. It's fine. We'll find a way. I mean, no, no, they just gotta start it now. We'll still find a way to all bust. No, they don't drop it. Give us the time. No, no, they don't know exactly how long it was. Right. Actually, they do. We've been sitting for two more hours. Nah, it's it's been like that for a while. No, the dealer the dealer wouldn't have pushed him. And like, what the hell's going on? He hasn't moved in like an hour. Yeah. See, there are many ways he can tell how much time has gone by and what the clock should actually say. And dealer rotation is one of them. Absolutely. Took like 45 minutes off that clock. We we skip a level. Well, no, you would have seen a different dealer in that time. That's very true. <laughs> so, no, they're not going to take 45 minutes. They're going to take probably mm, 8 to 10. Right. I'd guesstimate. I mean, I wouldn't take off the full amount. I would take off some. Right. Me know. But uh, you do have to account for the, the final table and the moving and, you know, give, give the players a little bit of a break. On the time. Did you get the Yeah. I like it for uh, half hour. Half hour? And then one of the Mondays, maybe? Mondays, like yeah. Yeah, that's what I like. Yeah, that's a good one. Dude, it's a movie. Yeah, right. for, the, for the Monday for the or half hour. Oh my God. I don't like to just go get half hour. Yeah. yeah. I went to. Honestly, that's yeah. why I got over Asian spots in the downtown area. Mm -hmm. Half hour or like in the middle exactly. of the night are the ways to go. Yep. I went to the one. Not, not me. Oh and then they have a whole like small play thing that's like six bits each. So we like yeah, a lot of these uh, yeah. ace yeah. rags that are playing yeah. these hands, yeah. nobody's really yeah. hitting. Yeah. Yeah. Like every meal. Yeah. Yeah. So those and threes, those right, no, sevens, yeah. and those fives, yeah. they're, time. they're getting away with a with a lot of stuff they normally wouldn't get away with. To, to, to try shit out, yeah. at least, to be, and then if you like it, you can go yeah. back and get. Like me and Carla, we went to go eat on a Monday, and I didn't know about the whole. That's like the best night to go because it's all in the day. We ordered probably like six, seven different. It was like 60. The, food, the food's good there, actually. Yeah, it was like 60. Oh, yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. Cacao on a clematis. I think they have one in Cacao as well, too. Yeah, it's pretty it's solid. They have some good stuff. It's pretty good food. Yeah. And then booze is cheaper, too. Yeah, like yeah, the, yeah. Like Well, every day, that Monday, 50% yeah, yeah, yeah. off is like the dumb deal. Great deal. I actually forgot it was Monday. Carly's like, hey, Kapow, right? I was like, oh, dude, I'm Free just kidding. <laughs> Not not me says ten to go with AK. They go ace king against ace queen, and yeah, that's about what I'd expect for ace king versus ace queen. <laughs> Flop mm. like that. <laughs> Turn card a seven. An a three. Let's have expecting an a ace or a pair again. Well, I so feel like anybody best to push the fold. Yeah. I will say if Justin did bet, he might have gotten him to fold. Right. Possibly. Yeah, he didn't get hit too bad. No. Small pot.
like curry and barbecue. I saw, oh, oh, I saw an ad for barbecue place up on the Safari Zone. Like curry and oh, barbecue. barbecue. Oh, barbecue. Oh, okay. Which one are you talking about? I forget the name. Usually I'm a barbecue snob now. I don't know if I told you. Yeah, was it no? I'm a barbecue snob. I don't know if, oh, really? if I told you. Oh, well, now no. I am. I wasn't before. Because of barbecue. barbecue. Yeah. Being, yeah. being tel- in Dallas? In Texas. Vegas. Wow. Mm-hmm. I mean, this this is what we look for. Oh, my God. Smoked brisket. That's sexy. We, we, got, we got a little of everything. That's sexy. You know, for our three-meat plate, and then we, like, mm-hmm. you know, divvied it up so we, could both, so we could both try everything. Right. That's awesome. Me and my brother, the... It was. <laughs> like I said, guys, if you've never had barbecue in Texas, ooh, it doesn't even seem to matter the city. Cause I've, I've been to Houston and I've been to Dallas, and both were great. <laughs> Fantastic. going to say, that now the table has moved to yeah, Mexican restaurants in Chicago. I'm like, eh. I would also reckon I, I would also recommend Texas for good Mexican restaurants. <laughs> I'm dying to travel more. Even the state, even the state side. I'm buying my time to the kids a little older. Right. Well, of course. Because the kids, I mean, to around with little kids. To take the kids to, even to like Texas, for example, it's not going to, they're not going to really What are they going to do? Right. Yeah. It's all a way to get older. I mean, there's a, they got a Six Flags over in Dallas. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've seen a little five or ten years. No, five years. Yeah. Yeah. Although by five years from now, my oldest will be Because I've be had barbecue 15. in other places. I've been to Carolina. I've been to Kentucky. I've been to Tennessee. Mm-hmm. And they were all really great. But, man, the, the smoke, they smoke everything in Texas. And yeah. And you know the saying, everything's bigger in Texas? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's true. Because I, I got sticker shock from the prices for right. a three meat plate, mm-hmm. <laughs> but the portions, dude. They were, I'm like thirty dollars for a beef rib, and I was about to say something, and then I saw the beef ribs. <laughs> Holy crap! It it looked like a a brick, like about the size of a red brick, you know? Right. I said, that's one rib, and I was like, oh damn, that's got a pound of food. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. I take back what I was gonna say. Right. <laughs> The guy could tell I was new to Texas barbecue too. Yeah. He's like, don't hold it by the bone, by the way. He like grabbed the tongs and he had the meat because as soon as I got to the table and I picked it up by yeah. the bone, it slid right off. It that's was the best. That's tender. the best. It's all like, oh, so I yeah, imagine, if I, I tried to pick it up I like imagine, that, it would have gone I imagine all the, the briskets are probably this is amazing too. Yeah. Ugh. So fantastic. Because I've had brisket before, but it, not like this. <laughs> Rib, ribs off the bone is one of the greatest things in the world. So my brother's like, so I can count on you coming back to visit, right? Because <laughs> that's he lives I, was, there? I was out there seeing him. He yeah. lives there, right? Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's. I went out to see him. He was trying to get me to come see him for a while. Mm-hmm. And he's like, and he knows my work schedule. He's all like, Panthers are playing the Stars on a Tuesday. Mm-hmm. And I was like, you got you me. Son, you son of a bitch, I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> Lenny rivering that ace. Wife doesn't care, right? She go, She doesn't care? She's not like, no. Well, usually I, I, I plan family trips around my hockey, this is why, which is why I've been to Nashville. Right. Because I got an uncle up there, and I've been to Chicago because mom's up in Milwaukee. Mm-hmm. And now my brother's in Dallas. So it's, People think hockey tickets are expensive. Try hotel rooms near NHL arenas <laughs> 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 on, you know, the night before a game because they know. Yeah. And, man, it's – it was nothing in the downtown Dallas area that was under three hundred dollars a night. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, one of the freaking the, the hockey tickets only cost me one forty. <laughs> I played blind. I, got I, o- I opened blind and I bet blind. So Lenny with a big lead here, by the way. Lenny had a big lead. Twenty percent of chips. I should have bet twenty five. I should have bet twenty five k on the turn. No, I bet twenty five k on the turn. But shout out to all the Dallas fans that might be watching. You guys were sports, sportsman like. You know, just didn't say much on the way out. In Tampa, a comeback like that, I definitely would. I definitely would have got a beer shower. <laughs> Scoring three goals and me just cheering for my team. You stayed two days there. Yeah, yeah, I was there for a couple. Yeah, I didn't go up just for the game. I was no, spent a couple days up there. Yeah, send them anyway. All right, I gotta let you go. Okay, by the way. Yeah, no, I'm not there. I'm playing so maybe if I find a cheap plane or whatever and I can go see my brother, I'm de- definitely going back to that barbecue joint. <laughs> right. Of course. <laughs> it might be the same one that I believe like uh, some of my friends went to when they went to WrestleMania back in 2015. 
Could be the same one. Oh, well, it's a chain. Like a well, not a chain, but a mini chain. Mm -hmm. Like in the Dallas area, it's still a family. So it's like se yeah, it's a family bit. There's like seven different yeah, yeah, yeah. spots. Okay. I doubt you went to the exact same one because this one was in Allen, which is about an hour north of town, which is where my brother's at. <laughs> right, Brian still with the top pair. Yeah. <laughs> Jay always makes that face when he folds. Like, who's that? Jay. Like, uh, uh, like I can't believe I got a fold. I'm like, dude, rats. You had nothing. <laughs> you don't. You didn't even have a halfway decent draw. You got you in can't cheap. Stick around. You got in cheap yeah, as this anyway. You can't stick around with that. Two pair now for Brian. Not sure what Vega was looking for there. There's he didn't really have any kind of draw. Well, he had a well. Yeah, I'm sorry. I take that back. He had a gutter. Six would have gave him a straight with his nine, but so he did have a draw. But he way missed. <laughs> Brian, pro pro he probably knows he's got the hand one. For a moment, I thought maybe he's thinking, what can I get him to call? <laughs> but uh, not all in, no. <laughs> and for those of you watching, uh, yes, you can watch the stream while you're playing on it, just not at the table. I can put that out there. Yeah. So uh, if you are ever on the show, and Oaktai, I don't think I didn't notice you sneaking in there. Oh, it's Oaktai. I didn't see him. He's not John Cena, right? He's pretty yeah. obvious. He's right there. <laughs> well, look at the screen. I'm, uh, I'm on the big screen right now. Three six blinds, by the way, guys. Yeah, my wife never gets that joke. Took her to see the Barbie movie, and when everything changed, John Cena was one of the movies. She's like, hey, she's like, isn't that John Cena? I'm like, how would you know? You can't see him. She's like, what do you mean? I said, you can't even see him. She's like, what are you talking about? He was in the mermaid outfit. I'm like, never mind. <laughs> Who's this? Uh, <laughs> my wife. No, he checked the team. He checked every time. No, he actually he was acting yeah. first? Yeah. All in. All in buttons are fun. Yeah. <laughs> Snap hold from Brian. Can't imagine Jay calling with 10 9. Power play. He brings my blind since I was at the other table every time. I had it. <laughs> I know, I had it. Gene telling him he's always John raising his blind. Ollie, it's, I don't know, man. I, I you mean, can't I play for it. Team Petty at the, in this game. Because <laughs> raising a guy just because he raised your blind, that's, uh, that'll get you in trouble. Deuce for Bry. B Rat. B Rooney. Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was brat. <laughs> I can hear that tall Josh now. Is he trying to get Family Guy to sue us? There. Poker's closer to chess at times than it is to cards. 
Yeah, he was beating <laughs> Tenpuri. He was beating Tenpuri. <laughs> yeah. He was beating Tenpuri. He put Ted hit with Goku and home. He opened with worse than Tenpuri. Yes, yeah, smooth pitch yeah, by Anthony. Spin. <laughs> the spin is nice. Jack Jack. He had Ten Jack. He had Jack. No, he, has, he, has he has Ten Ten. He had the last two Ten. ten. Yeah, Jack Jack. Incredible style. <laughs> See, there's another one I avoided. <laughs> I almost just donked it in with the clean red. No, it's cheapo. Cheapo is it? No way. No way. D no way. Zero percent. He's pulling it for fifty k. He called one thousand percent call. You don't play with him enough. Uh, <laughs> I know he's snapping. That's why I didn't get out of line. I'm, I'm looking at one card and just calling. Yeah, 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 he would have saw the ace first and called. Yeah, it's all. It's all over. I'm getting it in bad. That I did. Yeah, but you're that that would have happened. You're fucked with that. I mean, I'm live, but clean red. Why don't I see it? All right, new diva. Is that pun? No, well, not new, uh, but. <laughs> well, yeah. But why would we not? Oh, oh my God. Ace of diamonds exposed. <laughs> if it's the ace of diamond, yeah, turn it over. <laughs> no, if it's the ace of diamond, don't say nothing, bro. I was just kidding. I just randomly I said the ace of diamond. Because of the damn button we talked about, you tried to hit it. You can't break it with the cards. You can't break it with the cards. I can't see it. <laughs> Thirteen with his A tray. And nobody wants to play for that money. Lenny couldn't get any action with his king no. there. It's fine, he just has he has a hand every time. I only have a shitty hand. Maybe you should I wouldn't say Lenny's got yeah, a hand a, every I mean, time. Had a hand he did I have he know. absolutely had a hand this time. <laughs> Maybe not every time. <laughs> Kings against Queen Trey suited. Yeah, he no, had you that time. He was praying. <laughs> he was squeezing. Hey, look at the first one. He's like, oh, come on, please, he one time. Let me, get, like let me wake up with aces right here. Come on, one time. Woke, probably woke up with kings. He was squeezing his one time. You open with my hand on the, d on the, on the button. No, I, I don't even look at my cards. No, really? Well, you like that, huh? Squeeze him, sir. Squeeze him. There you go. Oh, you got to squeeze it over there. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. And a smile that said we got to fold. Matt never believes me, so. Get him, Matt. I know I got to Well, quit it. lying. I might oh. believe you. No, I'm just kidding. Actually, I don't think. What is Quan call it? A girl with a, with a big ass or something? What, what hand is that? Oh, Quan. It's queen. Yeah, something like that. Girl with a big ass. <laughs> <laughs> he said he called the girl with a big ass. 
Uh, he definitely did not come up with that. Uh, Miss Nancy did. She always have a nipple in the Yeah, she did. Is it called the smirk or the goose? She just has a nipple in it. I'm sad that I gave the goose like four days out of the week last week. Dude, I got. Ah, uh, why? <laughs> Vega with the King Queen of Diamonds. Table talk has shifted what towards the, the beach. Not against me, though. I think we should I am definitely you have to hold for um, right, got, more to towards my cheesehead half than my Florida yeah. half because I don't much care for the beach and never had. It's too hot, sand gets everywhere. <laughs> I won't lie. I, I like the beach, but. Growing up, I love the beach. Now, it's like, whatever. <laughs> I mean, I used to go to the beach all the time as a kid. Not because we liked it. I'm scared of sharks. We don't care. Um, I know it sounds crazy. Scared of sharks. Don't care. But we lived close enough to the beach where we could walk, and when there was nothing to do, and we didn't have any money. <laughs> yeah. We could always go down to the beach, hang out. <laughs> That's not the case. Everybody don't have any good cards to call your ass with. Tell me, if I had, like, King, King Queen or better, I would call But then I stopped being poor and got queen, Nintendo. Queen, so. <laughs> that was pretty much the end yeah, of the beach for me. <laughs> you tried to get into a mattress. Mattress been real, it's been real deal, you know. Well, he's got the suited flat tire, and he's not going to play. <laughs> Hard to blame him. Vega gets a walk with tens. Oh, and he shows the tens to the table. He's all like, really? I got to walk here? Yeah. It's rare to get a walk, even rarer than when you have a bad hand, I think. Because <laughs> you'll be the big blind. You're in for double the big blind because of the ante, and you're looking down at, like, you know, 9-4 off suit. <laughs> it's like three players raising you. <laughs> and there's one now. Here's Adam with uh, going all in for just under 50K with his pocket fours. <laughs> and Brian's looking jack nine off suit. He's like, yeah, I can't, can't call you there, guy. Sorry. Jack seven, six deuce, seven deuce, jack three. Yeah, I don't think Adam's going to get any action here. Gene pretending for a second he's going to call with 10 three. It's a good start. It's a great start. Yeah, it is a great start. It's a good start. I should have 10 It says, you know what? You, you can have it with your fours there, buddy. Enjoy. 10 three. Yeah, 10 deuce. So Adam is one of the shorter stacks, so picking up a free round of annies and blinds is pretty big in that spot. Pair. Pair would be nice. I thought it was aces. Even knowing it was fours. It did. That hand took a shift one, I was excited. I don't know if it's a hand to put shift one. What you looking for? You looking for I mean I thought for sure fives was gonna find a way to get it up. <laughs> this is the way. <laughs> Oh, we missed hand 69. We're up to hand 76. No. All right. Vega's got jack 10 off suit. And here's and he raises with it. And here's Gene with pocket 10s in the small blind. <laughs> so we might get some fireworks here. Re-raise. Adam has 6-3 off in the big blind. And see you later. Have a good day. <laughs> mm-hmm. And Vega decides Jack 10s might be worth 10, but it's not worth 35. The first time you come here and make a move, you get a raise, huh? Min raises. Uh, it works, though. That shit works all the time, though. It looks strong. It looks strong. Yeah. Yeah. I'm over here with, like, eight big blinds raising under the gun with, like, queen jack suited. And jack people seven just get off. Pull, jack seven off. You get them all the yeah, fold yeah. sometimes. That looks a lot more oh, strong than the all in. <laughs> Oh, this man, yeah. You can't beat C1, so that's your problem. Yeah, it's going to be tough to beat him. <laughs> He's like, I'm just going to Not just from a chip perspective, either. Yeah, it is. Lenny's got a suited A tray. 
Just gonna steal this ballet. Just and the chip I lead, he decides, no he thanks. Okay. I don't know, as, as I really hate limping, especially at a final table. Yeah. But with, if I'm the chip leader with ace three suited, eh, you know, there's, there's exceptions to make, there's exceptions to every rule. And then Gene just demonstrates why the rule is there in the first place. Don't yeah, limp. Hand on the <laughs> <laughs> because Gene made it 14 to go. All black cards. A four. Lenny's ace three would be winning right now, by the way. Not anymore. Gene rivers a jack. And for Brian, that jack on the river comes too little, too late. Because uh, he would have an open-ended straight draw if that jack came a little sooner. As it is, he just has 10 high. Gene shows him the jack. Chip stacks updated. Something's got to give here because only Gene and Lenny are not in the danger zone. <laughs> and we still have eight players. So. If the, if the play actually. doesn't get you, the blinds will. <laughs> it's just, it's just the nature of tournament. You guys want to come back early and pick yeah, 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 I'm going to stay here. I'm not moving. Okay, this is where the break should have been. We can't take a 10 minute break. Come on. Four minutes. All right. So they're just going to take a little four minute break. So that our tournament director can come on down. Uh, do a race off because we're going to get the blue chips out. But uh, the play is getting tight <laughs> because we're getting closer and closer to the bubble. We are paying five <laughs> spots today. Yeah. We're down to eight players. I need one of those. So before anybody sees any money, three of these players have to vamoose. Great plot for threes against the 6-5 anyway. But Gene bets it, representing a bigger hand than he actually has. Brian's not buying it. <laughs> <laughs> Snap call from Brian. Yep. Uh, Gene picks up a straight draw in addition to his two overs. Not that he knows a six and a five are overs, but they are to Brian's pocket threes. And Gene, Gene refuses to give up the story and says, okay, uh, you called last time. How about uh, 20K? I'm sorry, 16K. <laughs> and Brian's still not believing him. Ooh! Ouchies. <laughs> Six on the river gives Gene the better pair. And Brian has checked. Gene oh, checks. I don't know. Uh, if I'm in Gene's position, I'm probably not criticizing that play from Brian because he called you when you got chips. <laughs> All right, so a momentary pause in the action. Uh, for the color up. And uh, we will be otherwise be skipping the break because uh, when we moved the, the other table down when they broke to make final table, they already took up most of their uh, allotted break time. 
So they're just going to do a quick color up, and while they're doing that, let's run through everything that's going not on again. Uh, to those who did not tune in earlier, the Moneymaker Tour returns to PBKC Mon or not Monday, <laughs> May 2nd through the 14th. 28 trophy events, live streaming for almost all of them. Uh, head to moneymakerpt.com for more information. But that's May 2nd through the 14th for the Moneymaker Tour. And uh, here's here's something for the more charitable among us. The uh, the the uh, Rooney's 5K Run Walk to benefit Potentia Academy, PAL, and Connection School for Autism. Uh, that's happening March 30th. Um, no, you do not have to run. <laughs> you can you can walk. I mean, we we have the we have those. Uh, those really great runners that are probably going to run it in about 17 minutes. And then you got people like me who run slash walk in about 45. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but everything benefits a, gr a great cause, um, raising money for these uh, special needs schools. Uh, register today at buff.ly slash 3UBYEIW. Or click the link over at pbkennelclub.com. And, uh, oh, uh, uh, something else about the 5K. Let me just check to make sure, because I don't want to put any, any bad info out there. But, yes, with the 5K, uh, if you do sign up, whether you actually run it or not, or just walk it, big breakfast, the big Rooney's Pub breakfast that they do every year, which is sensational. <laughs> it's, it's really a great spread. And it's for all the runners after the race. It, it's free, obviously, after you've run or walked. <laughs> so it's for me, it's the biggest attraction. I mean, because they usually have these French toast sticks yeah. that are. Oh. <laughs> Don't get me started, man. Ooh, wow, Love that stuff. It's, it's a really great breakfast, and uh, you'd also be supporting a great cause as well. So uh, that's something that we do every Easter weekend. That's coming up Saturday, March 30th at 7:30 a.m. In fact, I, I think I'm in this picture. You know, with all the runners running out front, but it's just at the starting line. <laughs> I didn't finish up there. About. <laughs> mm -hmm. I kind of lackadaisically jogged back in. <laughs> like, I'll get there. Don't don't eat all the French toast sticks before I get there. <laughs> but no, I will not be run walking this time this year, unfortunately. Uh, one would think I wouldn't be in that much trouble, but uh, my wife was disappointed <laughs> since our daughter attends that school and she works there. Well, she wanted me to join her volunteer group, and I'm right. like, no, we have our own volunteer group. No, I have to, <laughs> I have to join mine at, at the kennel club. All right, back to live action. Vega is all in with a suited ace jack. Yep, seven big blinds. Vegas has three and a half because of the big blind Annie. His count is accurate. Gene's going to call with King Jack. No, nope, no protection. But with hands like these, do you really need it? <laughs> yeah. They're all some bad hands this round. Vega, not only with the higher jack, but suited. A commanding lead. I am not trying to block you. That's why I didn't raise. If I thought I could bluff you, I would raise you. Good luck, well, you can't yeah, bluff an all in. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, uh, well, you, you know what? Or you want to lose? Can you take a chop? There's no chopping. Until the king hits. Yep, yeah. Vega's ace prevails. Yeah. <laughs> Is that why Gene never roasts me? <laughs> wow, that's uh, that made me a little sad. Not like you know, verge of tears kind of thing, but a little sad. Because I fall. 
The point is because he hit the ace. That's the point. That's the only thing. You didn't win. Yeah, you didn't win. Yeah, you did your part. How much is that? It's on me. Yeah, I know, but I just want to know the count. That way we can speed it up. Everyone knows it's thirty-five. Thirty-four. I make one light call. Okay, that's it. No more. Five six off, huh? That was blue for him. <laughs> yeah, it's probably gonna happen. <laughs> you know, right? The best five's gonna. Oh, oh, he said. Oh, oh, oh that's not good. Eight five. King queen. King queen. Oh no. Oh, that's fine. That's a. It's a. That's a fair fight. Better than king well, seven. Well, eight five. He's still shot. All right, the, the ace seven against, against the king ten, queen. Huh? <laughs> He's already saying GG. <laughs> wow. And there's Mike Boy, assisting the our dealer with the, the uh, camera yeah, angles the for the all-in hands. Right. King, King oh, right yeah. in the window. <laughs> wow. You did a club. Uh, no, that's not a club. That's all over there, I think. Oh. Yeah, that's over. Yeah, seven caught up, but it didn't matter. Yeah. It's up way to go out. Let's go out. He shall. In eighth place. Unfortunately... There's no bubble yet. Bubble, yeah. Two, four, right, six, there's, there's no eight, bubble. Eight, five. Okay, top five. Yeah, I want, you said you wanted to even shop, right? Right now, all because you have more chips now. You would have. Yeah, I Ooh. don't think Lenny's going to go for an even right? shop. He's got 305 yeah, yeah, Miami style. Yeah, wait, now it's, yeah, it's, time now it's 30. Wow. Go heat. Wow. Go heat. Yeah, heat. That's brutal. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see. Oh, no! I just want to see what type of guy you are. You know, so in the March yeah. Madness I returns. You're supposed to say either way. Yeah. Yeah. You know the funny thing. Is yeah. Yeah. I have no idea how, how the NCAA does more it more with the seed. Right? No. I mean, no. FAU has lost twice guys. as many games. Now you're gonna be like, now we're playing now. As last year. Yeah, but mm -hmm. you never acknowledge. They're not ranked. The whole time we're trying to, we're trying to get it. You know? They lost to a well, you never, you never 11 seed in their own conference tournament. That's how they were eliminated. And just on a total, you know, downer heading. Into uh, yeah. the the oh, tournament, on, and yet somehow are seated higher Ryan, than last year when they only had three losses Adam. and they were ranked yeah. nationally. Yeah. The, we were a nine seed last year. We're, we're they're, probably, they're probably using last year's performance too, also <laughs> baked in. We're, we're we're an eight this year. It's like what do you how think? <laughs> they baked in last year's. I guarantee it. We lost to Temple. I'm pretty sure I, I really PBCC's really college team could be Temple. Five players. Yeah. Yeah. And Antoine the Don jumping in. Smack dab, come on, he says. You actually, Miss Nancy was in the chat earlier. You missed her. <laughs> Flopping a flush for Vega. It says Jay has a less than 1% chance to win. I'm not seeing it. Oh, okay, running 6-7 of spades. Okay, for a straight flush. I'm like, how could he possibly win? <laughs> yeah, Vegas, he's got the easily the best hand. I won in 117 chance, I'm told repeatedly by players. The odds of flopping a flush. I'll have to be on the lookout for that action in 15 minutes. There's a lot of whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey uh, going on over there. You got an ace too? King, queen, the diamond. Oh, followed by a big uh, aww. I, like <laughs> I don't think I like that either. <laughs> All the three short stacks, guys, and I'm part of them. I thought you were going to hope you were going to be able to dice this fucking fuck with me. I almost was. I know you're folding on my big blind. Nice four showing. <laughs> I got a four last time when I played. Last time you got it in, you got it in on my big line with four high. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. So I'm, I'm willing to put it in, just not with nine deep stuff. Man. Damn, we all going home with 600 right now. You see, you see, you yeah, see. Yeah, we all go. I never had all the chips. I had like one. I had a one ten max. I don't like it. What I'm are you talking about? I have sixty. I have seventy k now. 
I had like 110 men. I never had a lot of fish. Sorry, bro. It's 600 to everyone right now. But 600 a piece. 600 a piece, but now you don't want to do it. Huh? That's a good. Yeah. That's a good deal, actually. You know what? That's fine. What's the deal? I'll do it. That's I'm not a problem. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure about you, you Ernest, but uh, like, you know, I think me. I think everybody. I'm pretty amiable to chops. Yeah, yeah, depending yeah, on, you know, yeah, you mm -hmm. a lot of factors, well, ship stacks, how long we've been playing. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I might take a chop <laughs> 10 <laughs> hours in <laughs> that I would never, ever <laughs> take <laughs> six hours <laughs> in. <laughs> right. Yeah, depends on the situation. <laughs> right. But um, given Lenny's stack and that we're seven-handed, I don't think he's going to take an even chop. No, of course not. <laughs> Nor should he. <laughs> no, no, well, that's what Brian's saying. Hey, 600, if we all chop right now. And I'm like, uh, I think Lenny and Gene might have something to say about that. <laughs> Yeah, Brian would want to say that because Brian's also not now one of the lowest stats on the table. I mean, I get it. And, and, and that's not wrong with him asking the question, right. to, be honest, to be fair. No, no. it's But you know the answer's going to be there. Right. I mean, in this kind of game, if you're talking about ICM, is one thing. Yeah, you don't get points for trying <laughs> in this game. Right. I don't blame him for, for asking the question. But. But I think that answer is pretty, pretty easy to, uh, to see. <laughs> you know, if you're not even considering ICM at the, at the very least, I mean. <laughs> and then a reshove, yeah, when the player right behind him mm -hmm. just reshoves. That's it's very intimidating. I, I have to look down at something really strong before I even think about calling. Right. And nine five is definitely not it. <laughs> Queen Jack ain't it either. <laughs> eight six. No. Mm -hmm. I'm not looked at my cards yet, and if I have aces, it looks not as slow. Though. Brian claims. You can't have aces. I think if I have a pair of hands. Uh, yeah, you cannot show cards to other players. Mm -hmm. Okay. He's, He's last to act. He turns them up. No, no, he, he turned them up. Oh. Um, oh. And he'll avoid the penalty. Sam, I should have called. He got two plus shots, though. Because he was last to act, so he turned them up as he threw them in. So he'll get away with it. Ace, queen, ace, queen. Uh, it's not quite over. Running hearts. Turn it up. It's done now. 6 8 still looks good. Chop it up. No, no, no. chop it up. Six, I mean, six, eight never looks like good. I don't know why he'd say that. <laughs> so Matt and Jay, uh, we're just gonna hit the reset button. Why did I have like a queen on that one? You call six eight. Eight? Yeah, I call. Six eight? Yeah, yeah, I call any pair. Any pair I call. Anything over a pair, I'm calling to knock out two players. It's probably not that bad. Be honest. I'm calling just six eight. Well, if I win, I'm in the money. Yeah. Well, obviously, everybody is. You knock two people out, you're saying <laughs> five, genius. <laughs> oh, well. Hey, man, you know, you know, Gene stream, right? Can you, like, have more respect for me? <laughs> oh, okay, sorry. I mean, St. Patty's Day was a while ago, right? Three days ago? Yeah, three days. Still getting all these. Oh. I had to work on St. Patty's Day, so I'm kind of a little meh <laughs> mm -hmm. about it. I'm like, I'm an Irish Catholic. Shouldn't I automatically have that day off? Yeah, <laughs> for real. Because everybody's I Irish on St. Patty's Day, right? Yeah. <laughs> but see, if I walk around Oktoberfest and saying everybody's German on Oktoberfest, it's a problem. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Not fair. I like beer and schnitzel. <laughs> Well, the bubble, the bubble of the tournament was getting um, 32,000. Well, it was, it was some good times, but I was 
definitely down to get the Ferguson. All right, Adam with 9-7 suited goes all in. That's, uh, yeah, that's that's going to be nice. You did a close your business. Yeah. Brian's got King Jack. He's actually got a good hand to call with. Call him X, because X can give it to you. Get the one side of the 50 for sink. <laughs> yeah, Jay's got 7-6 off. And again with the look. He gives that every time he folds his big blind. I looked at the king first before I said the king. I like these cards to big blind. All right, king jack yeah, against 9-7 like suited. Yeah, these kind of hit a lot. And we'll see this run out. There you go. Oh, open-ended straight. Long suit, though. Yeah. But an open-ended straight, though. Jack or six. Pair oh, yeah. sevens yeah. also yeah. hits that. Nine. River card, oh. a nine. And that will hold. Oh, my God. I didn't see That's that. gross. I didn't see that either. Straight to the jack. Yeah. Wow. Bubble? And uh, me, then there were six. No, you I didn't see that. Yeah, Brian just went from sixth right? to third. Good oh, luck. Okay, next dealer's well, in. Is that the Pimon again? Yeah, and they're discussing a, just a bubble. Yeah. Do no, just not from first, just from all the spots. Yeah, 20, 20, 20 from all the spots, that's fine. Um. Wow, I didn't even know I had a straight draw. Yeah, that's actually 100 bucks. I was going to say, that's not going to cover the bite. Yeah, yeah, 25 yeah, 25 off each five. 25 still won't cover it. It'll be five bucks short. <laughs> You're paying top, top five, top five right? right? Yeah. So to, to get your buy-in back, uh, the actual the actual number is 26. I know, I can hear the chat now. Nerd! <laughs> 16. Bless you. Fifteen to go. Matt has the better hand, but I mean a pair of aces on the board, two more overs to your sixes. That's a tough bet to call. And it goes without saying, it's it's always tougher when you can't put your opponent on on a hand right when the range is so wide and their play is so varied and well jeans uh we've seen him at the final tables before he will literally do the same things when he's bluffing versus when he has the stone cold nuts so it's not being able to read be, your opponent not being able to read you is, is such a great thing to have more the serious than the main event <laughs> this shit just got serious and we gotta quiet. Get, we gotta get you a drink. This, this shit, this shit just got serious and quiet. We're in the bubble, man. It's like a $200 fee jump right now. Oh, shit. Be careful. All right. Vegas ace oh, against boy, Lenny's ace queen. No, this is ace too, too smart. He's not gonna run into it. Ace queen versus eights, and only one club. Check. I don't know. I think maybe Vega might have been able to bet Lenny out of it. Instead, he checks, and Lenny's going to fire. Going to try to bully him with his chip stack. <laughs> and it's Pokemon style. It's super effective. I thought about raising chip stack, too. He would get smacked again. Nah, I would have beat him. I mean, he's going to re-raise him. You would have hit the board. I did not hit the board. 
ones that I had six high with a lot of them um, out. <laughs> He's got no blood pressure. Watch the stream. You setting yourself. You setting yourself up for bad. He's got thing. no blood pressure. I would never say something like that out loud. Yeah, that's. <laughs> even if you're not being streamed, that's that's not a good thing to say. <laughs> Thirty-seven. Come on, Gene. This ain't millionaire. You don't get to phone a friend. All right, Matt's all in with King Jack. Brian's thinking about calling with Queen Ten here. Brian's done well the last few of these, and well, he's gonna gamble here. Try to knock Matt out. <laughs> he is behind though. 60 40. Oh, we have a chance. Let's go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> All right, into the flop. Oh, oh whoa, it's a good flop. It's a good flop. A, a gutter for a Brian. Queen, or a ten. queen 10 oh, or 9. No, that's not a queen 10 or hey, 9. Hey, nice playing with you, man. Oh, and he hits the nine. What? <laughs> Says nice playing with you <laughs> while he's behind and then catches on the river. Brian's alive. Wow, right. Brian's alive. He knew he was going to suck out. <laughs> and Matt is a better Matt than I am. That's why it's called Matt, not me. I know. He's, he's better uh, in the sense the that Brian went over to shake his hand after saying that. Really? I don't yeah, think I – I mean, eventually, yes. I'd have been like, <laughs> you know, you know let's still be friends with the guy. Whatever happens, happens. happens. Right. But immediately after I get up, that's not the time to go for the handshake, my guy. I'm sorry. That's your biggest I'm going for a trophy. No, I'm going for a trophy. Hold up, Matt. Hold up. Nice playing. with. Yeah, see, you know what? Face That's a dead one. hand. I don't get it yet. I haven't won yet. <laughs> That's the trophy. All right. That's Thank the you. trophy, bro. I'm gonna take that as a uh, as a trophy. sign 47. as a sign that it's coming to me. <laughs> All right, take it with fours. Fun, bro. That's the trophy. We're playing for that, bro. Well, should put, you should put it on the table. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. Like here, bro. No, you should not do that up, ever. Over here, we'll put it right here. Actually, we'll put it on the chairs. Heads up, we'll put it on the table. All right, yeah, dude, I'm down. It, it's, not, it's not heavy at all. <laughs> I gave that to the guy that said I want it first. I was like, here you go. I hate this trophy. <laughs> really <laughs> thinking about <laughs> these fours. <laughs> <laughs> he yeah, had aces. He has aces, and he's still up. <laughs> he's looking like he wants to see He's it. sweating. Dude, so you, you ahead. Yeah. yeah, like, relax, bro. Why are you getting up? If you watch the game, you never know when it's up to yeah. go. Call 47. All right, boys. We got a chance for Seven a big pain jump. Seven of diamonds is full. Seven of diamonds is full. Can't do the pain like that. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, my God. Pair it up one time. Good. That's great. All right. Okay. Oh, we got <laughs> ace queen. We got fours it's, and it's king qualified. deuce. They qualify. They qualify. From so Jay. These guys always come each other. God damn. It's halfway yet. So maybe. Forty-seven, twenty-one. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a, a raise. It's a raise now. God, and he saw Ooh, my. Ooh, it is a raise. There was yeah, enough in there to constitute oh, a raise. Fine. I think I have to, anyways. I'm yeah. Okay. I can't, and then I can't Vegas all in. Now. We're all in here, buddy. Well, now you've got Ace Jack again. Yeah. Ace Jack, no. <laughs> no, he does I not have Ace yeah. Jack. Yeah. If you have Ace Jack, you can. <laughs> He's got fours, yeah. Oh, wow. King, dude, son. What do I got to put? 40K. I got the. I'm putting the 40K. Hold on. Wait a couple. Hey, nice plan with you guys. Uh, uh huh. See, he says nice playing with you guys after knocking out it was nice playing with you guys. Matt. Yeah, and, and he thinks he's gonna catch his card now. Hold up, no, I got you. <laughs> I got you, bro. dude. They're gonna look at the street and say, "What the hell's going on here?" Careful. 
Let's gotta, put the ace of hearts just for a sweat. Yes! Oh, four. Oh, Flop's the flush! And a four! Oh, wow. I'm going to die. Heart, two. I need a heart, no. And no, I, if I hit a heart. You got two pair. I win, don't you I? You got a flush. He has a flush. He has a flush. You win the outside. How do you get the outside? I don't want the I get an outside flush. I'm still in it. Yeah. Everybody's still in it. Yeah. So Brian says, nice playing with you. To Matt gets gets his card to come, says it before even the flop this time. He left himself and and Jay flops the flush, and Vega flops the set to demolish his hand. I'm not getting up like that no more. Fucking Firestone. <laughs> you got that Firestone bad run right there. Gorilla Firestone. <laughs> <laughs> it works for both of you, except for. Damn, man. Waking up with Ace Queen there, two all in. That was like the dream. Yeah, I did actually raise the heart. <laughs> Should have never done that. <laughs> what, what? That was an accident. Like. <laughs> well, if I hit a heart, he's out. We, I needed a heart. Honestly, I didn't notice either when he said, Oh, keep it on the read. What? <laughs> I'm like, damn. Check. Mm, nothing for Appreciate either it. player. Common when neither player flops anything. First one to bet wins. And so Brian bets. Sorry, you're playing and so he wins. You're like spot on, like you just know. Are you some kind of like professional that we don't know about? <laughs> He's a savant. Yeah. He's a fucking savant. <laughs> ah man, we don't want this turn to be over. He, he smashed. Yeah. You hit the eight. The eight. We saw it right in the window too. And then you hit your along ace. With, along with so you many hit, hearts. You hit your ace and then you were last. <laughs> that was sick. No, but if, if I hit a heart, that's fine because there's a side pot. I break even. Yeah, but like the fact that you hit your card and then everybody catch up to everybody. Yeah. 5, 10, 10, the blinds now. I break 25K even. on orbit. 24. Yeah, that's fine. Like, I, I would have been all right with that. Because we knocked out another player. I take the small side pot and break even. He didn't fuel and break even because he called the main for well, 47. He, he had a, how much? 47. 47. Yeah, but there's like 60k. There's 27, like 60 something. 27 on the side. 27 on the side. Yeah, 54 on the side. Yeah, it looks like, what, like 20. 20k? Yeah. Okay. I'll, take, I'll take that hit. Yes. And we knocked out another player in like big K jump. So like still playing. And it's just 525? No, it's no, dude. It's like, <laughs> not even that because it's um 25, 25 bucks less. Yeah. Bucks, yeah. I'm just trying to get the fuck out of here already. I got I got things. <laughs> well, going down south? Small one. No, no, no. no I'm well, going down no. well, now his desire to chop seems a bit more palpable. Well, the fact, the fact he hasn't changed his stance, even though he's chipped up, it's, it's, it's you know, he's consistent. You know what I'm saying? Right. So I'll give him that. But no, what I was saying, if he were to talk about an ICM chop, you know. 35. Then now it's better because he he only had about thirty five k when he first mentioned the word shop. Now he's got uh, I think one hundred and forty k, and they're also in the top five. So I just started about that money. Crazy. Super sad. He was riding a motorcycle too. The other day I was like, somebody just passed by me, and then I remember he was bouncing with a helmet. He said he just on. left the tournament. They said that he just had left uh, Daniel. Daniel, yeah. Yeah, and then that happened. Top of ninety-five. Um, I don't know exactly yeah. how it happened, but I heard he just had to just leave the tournament. Yeah. He he was like in a stop sign. Ball four, take your base. Yeah. Oh man, oh, he's a solid player. Too. Yeah, very solid. Yeah, he, he got yeah, hit. Somebody hit him from that. behind and like smushed him. That's what I heard. I don't. Your finger was fatter than. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. It's such. It's very good shit too. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. Twenty-four. Twenty-four. Oh, this is Yeah, that 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 yeah. made.
made yeah, me think twice yeah. about. I have a slingshot, so I'm like, man. No, you I'm like, flip, bro. It's gonna be right in that shit, bro. <laughs> yeah, so I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna slow down and not. Nah, it's down the ground. Get that shit back up. Mm-hmm. Not saying that 17 for you old would be bad at all, but my nigga, Check. once you get got into it, mm-hmm. you just gotta fucking slow down. There's a lot of times. Somebody can hit you. 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 Neither of you hit the board. Stop arguing about it. <laughs> You'll see later on. It was going to say G- Gene turned a four. <laughs> but neither neither player hit the board. Exactly. Making good calls with Gene Hyatt. Give me some stuff. Did I make a call with Gene No, I didn't. I'm making good calls with Bucky Street and getting you on the road and shit. You're like, what pair? I said, oh, my God. Here comes a stupid-ass fucking five six or something. <laughs> or a four. <laughs> I knew that was going to be the case, too. When you said what pair, I said, oh, my God. Uh, you know, the best one is, uh, 20, you said, uh, you pair of ace, you said, what's your kicker? And you know you're good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he goes, I have an ace. What's your kicker? Oh, you're cooked. You are yeah. cooked. Kicker? What are we talking about? Yeah, kicker. Yeah, kicker? All right, so it's Gene's 10-8 suited you know, against Lenny's A6 off. And the flop. Not beneficial. Uh, yeah, I was about to say because of the hearts, but Check. Gene 59. did his 10. 59. Jack on the turn. So, nothing for Lenny to catch but an ace here. River card. A six of diamonds. Two pairs. Calling me with ace high. Jesus. Just one diamond short. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, you gonna I give him a flush? Are you gonna give him a flush item? Anything else you wanna do? <laughs> <laughs> Anything else you wanna do while you're at it? I'm gonna take this trophy home. <laughs> I'm trying to. I'm trying to just. I just want people knocked out. Doesn't look like you're walking for it because you're trying to give this guy a flush when he doesn't have one. <laughs> you can't troll the trolls, man. <laughs> I think you did hold on for fifteen thousand. You guys wanna take home eight forty? <laughs> <laughs> Still pushing hard for that even, Joe. Oh, we could just wait for one more player to be out. And I'm not talking about Sweet Sweet. Sweet Sweet. There's no Sweet Sweet. Kind of Sweet Sweet, right? One, two, three. I mean, I guess I should uh, jump at that, right? Because that's double for me. I guess I'll go for it. I mean, you got the more. more you can talk everybody team. else into it. Uh, with those chip sacks, uh, I don't Check. think Brian's going to be able to. No. Talk him into it. <laughs> I, I know he ain't doing that. Jay, Jay di- and look at the I smile on Jay's done. face. He's so happy. Look at him. He's I laughing. He's smiling. Job. Nobody raises big blind this time. <laughs> <laughs> so Lenny and Jay both flop. You got, you got your club draws. Jay just it's thinks he wants another club. But Lenny would have the higher oh, flush oh, if it does man. come. All right, Lenny hits a 10, so he no longer needs the club, but he's going to check it. River card. River card. There we go. <laughs> Four diamonds. <laughs> so, yeah, Lenny showed his cards, and he's all like, <laughs> he's saying thank you to the dealer for not putting a club out there. <laughs> All right, this is the trouble with playing too conservatively mm-hmm. in a format like this. Um, they're joking that Vegas in for half a stack in the big line. It's not quite half a stack. But. Yeah, but you got to pay two people. 
Ooh, Gene's got an ace nine under the gun, and Brian's right behind him with kings. Three. And Gene has raised. 25. I'm not sure how you don't call with kings at, at the minimum. And depe depending on how froggy he's feeling, maybe raise him. And ooh, he's feeling very froggy. 85, he says. Here's Lenny with the chip lead and 9 4 off. Uh, I can probably guess his move. <laughs> Folds instantly. Vega folds. He was in for more than half a stack out of the blinds. He's down to nine. Uh, yeah, he's down to 9K by folding there. He's going to be close to all in. Next hand, blind. I think I made it far too much. I might have to fold again. What you got behind? Five. He's raised. <laughs> I do like the confidence. <laughs> I mean, if you, if you can't believe in yourself, who's going to believe in you? No, I'm in court. You can't do that. I mean, that's with kings against ace nine, that's the right move. I actually didn't want you to call me because I did have kings. Tells the truth and shows them the kings. Uh, not when this guy has 9k. No shot. Brian immediately withdraws his previous offer of a chop. Mm -hmm. Now that Vega cannot afford a big blind. He's in for more than half of his stack just in the small blind. Yeah, you can't flat. All right. Yeah. Even eight check. Lenny, yeah, eight three. Yeah. Jay with ten three. <laughs> can't even call blinds with this, can you? Ooh. Good luck, all in. All in for less. So right. even even if Gene hated yeah. his hand, which he, it looks like he kind of does. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a hand I mean, there's nothing for it but to check. Yeah. He's exactly. got ace nine. Which is pretty good. There's a four check. Ten. There's Nothing. a ten for Jay. What's the turn card looking at? Ace, ace for Vega. Four. And a four is Vega hits the ace so there. Right? Lose. Yeah. So, yeah. But oh, side so pot. So um, Jay's going to get the side, that tiny 2K side pot yeah, with his ten. Ten or two. Just fold it. No. Oh, ten. Never. Pair of tens gets the tiny. Gets the tiny side pot, and Vega's going to get the main four, four. Okay. which is a slightly more than a quadruple up <laughs> because of the ante. And even though he only had 9K and couldn't cover the ante, he gets all the ante. <laughs> which is why uh, a quadruple up would have been 36K, and he's got 37. He is still last in chips, still only a round and a half of blinds. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> not to say yeah. Yeah. it has brought him back dad, into no. the game, no. but uh, yeah. 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 his plug. <laughs> well, no, I said I wouldn't say that even with uh, just an orbit and a half of blinds, but um, it, he didn't get the plug pulled on him. <laughs> right, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> of his yeah. life support. Uh, point, no, yes. it's it, it's still plugged in. <laughs> Twenty five K in orbit and only thirty seven K to play with. <laughs> it's it's pretty much shove at anything decent before the big line gets there. So Brian got the best of that with a deuce on the flop. Turn card is an ace. He says, Do you always have well Gene definitely has it now. He's got the ace. I think Check. that is a bald-faced lie. <laughs> 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 yeah, Gene snap bets. He does not believe <laughs> that they're chopping, like, even a tiny bit. <laughs> I think we're chopping before he puts out the blind bet. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, those chips are mine. Just give up now. Save yourself the trouble. <laughs>
Ooh, and Brian's gonna pay him. And Gene shows on the ace. Pay off boys, we can have a free right. Do you have it? To be fair, he did call it. <laughs> he said, do you always have it? I'll pay you. Well, <laughs> you can't be surprised when you lose. Mm -hmm. Because you, you, he had it, and you paid him. <laughs> yeah, but the thing is, like, once you check the pan, you have to call the rear. Yeah, really. Then I'm bluffing everything. I can actually fold. Not for that person. why I don't get into the table talk when I'm playing. Mm -hmm. It's it's too much of a mind bender. <laughs> okay, remember when I said anything decent? Here it is. Vegas got pocket nines. It's five handed and the big line's coming. I don't think it's gonna get much better. Gene immediately snap folds nine four. Brian has an ace, ace five, and he's gonna call. Lenny is in the big well, line with Jack like 10 off suit. Not my second buy-in, so I'm <laughs> sure I've lost. But he's already in the pot for 20k, in. so another 27 might not be that much of a stretch At the final table, to him, I don't know. and yeah, it yeah, isn't. I think he might be right. You get the side pot, yeah. Oh yeah, no, no, yeah, that's, that's, that's yeah, right. Oh shit, I was about to flip over my cards. Again? Oh, all right, so it's nines against Ace Five and Jack 10. And there's a five for Brian. And there's an ace for Brian, two pair. Two pair. All hands. Two pair. Two pair. Two pair. Ace five. Oh, man. Ace oh, five. River gets it. That's a bad beat. The only card in the deck that's supposed to go up right there. No, I had a deuce nice also. Deuce, deuce was good, too. Uh, yeah, Deuce would have gave him the straight. So, Vega, <laughs> <laughs> staving off elimination for a long you time. You did a good job. With the short stack. Pick his spots, hit some good hands, and he's going to walk out of here with just shy of $450. Not a bad day's work. It's not about being pros, dude. If I've got you four to one in chips, I'm not going to take an even chop. Now I'm like this prideful shit, you know? Now it's all pride. Got, Dude, what are you, a Super Saiyan? <laughs> it's about his Saiyan pride, Kakarot. <laughs> <laughs> Rest in peace, Toriyama san. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had to work at some Dragon Ball there somewhere. <laughs> what this? <laughs> yeah. And Jay's like, chip chop. Or you gotta call even her. chop. He's like, no, fight with honor. <laughs> So going, he's going ahead, though. Yeah, Jay's Jay's a six against Lenny's queen nine. Oh, he's got the mat going too. Oh, nice. Hit a six. a six and a queen. Queen though. Six. Ooh. Nice oh, oh, river. The devil on the river. River to six. Three sixes. Six da ship. Damien. Butt down, right, Damien, Jay? You it, ain't going anywhere yet. It's all for you. <laughs> I'm not gonna ICM. If you're gonna chop ICM, right? Uh, Gene is now the chip leader. After that, uh, Gene has him a little more than two to one over Brian, not over Lanny. Right. <laughs> Brian jumping into the chat. I'm the best negotiator. He mm -hmm. says. <laughs> Well, the numbers are definitely different than they were a couple of hands ago. <laughs> so that is a factor. I'm just saying, if I've got somebody three to one in, in chips, uh, I say no to the even job. Mm -hmm. And I'll say no every time. All in. But if it's closer, and I've only got, you know, and I'm less than two X up, you know, we, we can talk. Brian, I'm watching. I've done nothing but watch since we started. <laughs> He's saying, watch this guy. In fact, I've been watching more than you. <laughs> because you're on your phone in this shot. So. <laughs> you want to take 9-4 to a piece or keep playing? Gene. You want to take 9-4 to a piece or keep playing? I mean, clearly yeah, he's not no phones on the he's, not, he's not even answering him, so clearly he's not. That's not the case. I 
Now, that's that Brian does have a case he made to at least get some close to him because he has chips also himself. Right. Back when he had like 70K, no, there was no chance. But he's he's chipped up some and. Melanie well, is still. Mm -hmm. I mean, peanuts is all. It's all related yeah, to the situation. Peanuts, you know, peanuts for someone right. on the table. You know what I'm saying? So it all, it all depends. That's not really exactly. accurate. 940 is all is all determined oh, over the play really? itself. He let me play. Oh, what a minute. Let me play. And he raises an air. Raises. Well, he's, he does have seven. Right. Yeah. So that, that's fair. So Brian's king queen, though. Two, two big overs here. So this, this could be. Let's get, a little, let's get a little dangerous here. And G, G looked like he wanted to play them suited connectors. That's not bad. 98 yeah. suited. But do you stay away from the raise and see if Brian wants to play in the small blind? Yeah. The king Queen, yeah, yeah he I he wants to play. Been talking about this. I don't even know. I, this time I would jam every time with this hand. And well, if you would jam, I know Lenny would call you. Because yeah, it would have been a race. Seven's out. Nice it would be a nice flip. Nice. Yeah, it, 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 it would have been a flip. Eight so are we doing it or no? Okay, I'm I'm cool with it. Updated chip stacks. I'm always cool with it. I'm always cool with Lenny it. didn't quite grab Make the chip the lead back from Gene. Oh, Gino's <laughs> Gino's name. Yeah, right. I mean, Gino is a chip lead right now. By a little bit. The all three. The thing is, all three, yeah. all four guys are actually within within 100, uh, 200k. Yeah, this and the, I think they're close enough in chips to where you think about it because they're all in the danger zone. The blinds are so high. Right. And it shouldn't have gone this long. Everybody's in the danger zone. Everybody is less than 10 big blinds yeah. from elimination. And four handed, I mean, if. Wait, no, 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 <laughs> Just like a mini run of being card dead can cripple you when the blinds are this high, and you've got less than ten big blinds. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that would be another reason to take the the even chop in this scenario. Right. Even though the chip stacks don't, I mean they're they're getting closer to reflecting that. But so that's it. All right. Even chop. Good job as always. Shout out to our production team, of course. Shout out to the production team. Yeah. Shout out to. Uh, Are you the <laughs> <laughs> yeah, who had to take? We had Bronson, we had Gene, we had. Uh, and Mike, of course. Great job. As we uh, about to bring it in here for the final touch here. Yes, yes. And Brian's laughing at us in the Brian, chat. good job, man. <laughs> Brian, Brian, what you are is this. You're a great negotiator. Great negotiator. Greatest oh, in the world. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, when, you, I when you said I no, say when, the you, when you said when you said I get on the best negotiator, the first thing that came to mind was Trump. It's like greatest I mean, negotiator ever. I get it. So. I mean, when he first started negotiating, he had 50k in chips, and he ended up with 160. Right. So well, to be fair, I, I, it's well, a lot easier to get that deal at 160 Brian, than see, it is to get it at 50. Both <laughs> guys weren't wrong either, too, because <laughs> on one hand, Lenny had a case to not have a chop. Yes. On the other hand. Brian stayed consistent yeah, the entire he, time. He, he was got, consistent the entire time when he was low stack. Right, he was low stack. He still asked for chop. Where I mean, may be. Lenny, Same doesn't matter. So Lenny was just south of four to one at one point, right. and no, he just get, get, kept getting chipped down. So right. that, so that contributed to it. There you go. But anyway, that's going to do it here for us here on this Wednesday. Be sure to tune in same time tomorrow for our uh, PLO tournament. That's right, PLO tournament. Yeah, PLO tournament. Mm -hmm. So uh, hit the like, subscribe, and notification button especially because when we go live, you will know instantly when we go live. So. Uh, until then, I'm Matt. And I'm um, the Ernest speaking one, Ernest Christian. So and uh, whoops, wrong way because it's backwards, right? The camera, right? It's the stage left. Uh, have B a good day from, uh, from PBKC, the Action Palace, and we'll see you next time.